Hello. Hello. Back. I'm back. Are we supposed to be wearing cleats? When are we doing cleat week? I saw that on Friday. Yeah. Briefly. It's right. just Che. Is it just one person? Oh, nice. Yeah. Where are your cleats at, Che? I uh, I will be ordering them. I reached out to someone over the weekend. About so are you going to play the yak basketball at them? No. Will's first. <laughs> what do you mean you reached out to somebody? You just buy cleats? You just buy cleats. You reached out to a big cleat. Did you reach out to Tampa to get some Tampa Bay cleats? I did. Oh, <laughs> of course he did. Why do you have to reach out to somebody to oh. get shoes? Well, uh, one of my guys there does the uh, has a foundation and like the my cause my cleats thing. So I talked to him. On Saturday. Oh, you're gonna make it about charity? Well, then I can't make no, fun no, of you. No, 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 they sending no, you Tampa no, Bay no, cleats? No, he, uh, we can't do that one. So I will be ordering cleats. So okay. We'll next week. What would your cause be? That one. <coughs> the National CMB Foundation. <coughs> Whoa. Yo. Whoa. Yo. What was that, bro? You, what was that? A cough. The boys are sick. The boys are sick. Um, Sass has been sick all yeah, since last week. Like that side of the room has been sick for a while. But not me, though. Well, not actually sick, just the sniffles. Thrown. I'm sick to my stomach. Yeah. I'm fucking sick of the way that the world's been treating me. Sick mm. of my own actions. Sick of fucking losing. Sick of fucking losing bets. What actions? I didn't cash out a uh, uh, thousand to win forty thousand. No. That was... probably would have been about twenty thousand after game two, at least maybe twenty five. Even look. I'm sorry, after game three, it was fifteen after game two. That would have been nice. Did you not look? Not after game three, no. Uh, after game two, I, I looked. I watched the stream on Thursday night. I was convinced that Tico was going to flash everyone, um, and you just sat there sad as she just shit down my throat. Shit down your throat. And it wasn't like a tidy fucking compact turd. She fucking sprayed. Yeah, she messed you. <laughs> she got, she messed my face. The, the back of your throat got messed. Yeah, she fucking, yeah. Sprayed Machine gunned it. hot diarrhea down my gullet. Yeah. And, the uh, rest of the week, if you opened your mouth, people were like, is that a, it's a, is that a stain? It's a Tico poop? Yeah, Tico, tico yeah. poop. It looked like I drank Thai iced tea and it was oh. sitting on the base of my tongue. It was orangey. Oh. At least we got the Smitty video out of all of that. Yeah. <laughs> Smitty fell. I was saying it reminded me of that one video where, like, someone's filming a car accident and then someone just falls off the roof yeah. behind them or yeah. something like that. It was just the perfect It, it looks like he chaos. got dropped from above. I want to yeah. thank everybody. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Oh and the God. balloon falling from the sky oh was like misdirection. It was it's like, so, where did the balloon come from? He's so oh composed God. during it. You see, he doesn't spill the drinks. I don't even know how he fell. It, it looks like he was he stepped thrown. on the arm of that chair. Those chairs are uh, deceptively yeah. unbalanced because of yes. the like. S They've seen a lot. Legs everybody. that they have too. The I can't oh believe the legs God. are straight up because they're shitty oh screwing legs. Damn. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is. She also celebrated like this after game five. Mm -hmm. Yeah. After almost every game. After yeah, like a the, single. The Yankee series, yeah. You could convince her that there's another game tonight. You should. Yeah. No, you could. And you should just replay That's a stretch. game. I feel like you could. They're playing it back. There was a technicality. Oh, that wasn't. There's a uh, double World Series. They got to play the the Dodgers and then just replay that World Series. Exxon's <laughs> Exxon's Dolphins uh, is going to be awesome though because she is the anti Frank the Tank. Yeah, she can find joy or positivity in the most bleak scenarios and always spin something as a positive, and that's the polar opposite of what the tank does. Yeah, she's on board for all Houston sports now. I think so. I mean, she's a Number one baseball fan in the world. Mm -hmm. The world. She got out of a speeding ticket today. She got pulled over for speeding. And the cop was like, you're that Astros fan from TikTok or whatever from Twitter. Wait, and she got out of a speeding Where ticket. was she speeding? She posted uh, down in Houston. She's like famous down there. She Damn. became this boosted her down there big time. She asked me if it was the Astros girl from her. Wow. Yeah. Wow. They would have put Roan in jail. Yeah. And was it Bregman's got the wife? Death penalty. Tech singer? Or somebody's wife, some of the baseball players' wives are texting her. She's like, she's probably going to be like on a parade float, I think. Like, I think she really. No one deserves it more than not her. Not on their wow. radar. Yeah. Yeah. She really. She really does deserve it. Yeah. I agree. Ride or die. I'm 15, just happy it was her. Could have been $20,000, though. Oh, 40. 40. Or for, for 20 if I cashed out. 40 if they won. If they just won it, it would have been out of my that hands. I wouldn't have to bear this guilt of bad decision making on my shoulders on forever. Huh? It's your team. That's what I and that was my thinking that it was my team and that I only want to be right. I bet because I'm trying to remember that I was right about something and but I was wrong. Imagine and you cashed out and they won. 
Yeah, because you need to have the. Then ticket. they would have still won. Well, you've been and double was, happy. Yeah, it would have been right, double happy. Whatever. Yeah, that would have been double no, happy. He gets twenty thousand dollars and they win the World Series. He would be mad that he didn't get the full. Four. Yeah, but not as mad as he is now. I no, am bitter. You turn Stevens' mic up just yeah, his mic. Mm-hmm. I am deeply bitter right I mean, now. Where did Zah go? Zah was here for Pick Central. How was everyone's weekend? Otherwise. You see, we got a new presenting sponsor. Yeah, Morgan and Morgan. Oh, I okay. This is dope as hell. So, have you been in an <laughs> what accident the recently? Fuck? <laughs> have you slipped at your neighborhood grocery <laughs> store? Not been getting yeah. paid what you deserve at work. Morgan and Morgan is here to help. Morgan and Morgan is America's largest personal injury law firm. They have over eight hundred attorneys and offices across the country. Even better, they are completely free to work with unless one uh, win your case. Going up against the big companies for the money you deserve requires having the big guns on your side. Visit ForThePeople.com slash yak to see if you have a case. It's no cost to you. That's ForThePeople.com slash yak. Uh, I want I want yak listeners to win some cases. Yes. Yeah. I also I have a, a – now I have a – got to have a case race. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> wow. Oh. A Morgan and Morgan case, case race. No, if yeah. any yak really? fan out there – is is thinking about if they need to use Morgan and Morgan, use Morgan and Morgan, yeah. and then email us and we'll feature your case race. Yeah. Yes, we could yes. have two cases simultaneously no? running. What, Stephen? Oh, it's laws? Funny. You can't do that? No, they should check out Morgan and Morgan. They should check out Morgan and Morgan. Yes. Okay. Right. Check out Morgan and Morgan. I actually have a personal story about Morgan and Morgan. I met the founder Morgan? this weekend. Morgan mm-hmm. or Morgan? I think he was one of the more. I think it was Morgan. Oh. Huh. Huh. Um, at Keeneland, he was uh, he was there. I had a great conversation with him. Good people. I could just tell by his vibe, he's a guy I want on my side. So Morgan and Morgan for the people dot com. And not only are they sponsoring the show, they're sponsoring the wet wheel. Oh, oh. All right. So by the way, I, I saw I I was out Thursday and Friday. I was traveling, so I I wasn't able to catch the show. Um, so I was just kind of like, usually I'll just go on Twitter, see what see what the buzz is about, pop in the comments. People were upset about the wheel. I think maybe we need to rebrand the wheel in terms of just brainstorming some fun things we can put on there, get excited again about the wheel. Yeah, it was yeah. miserable yeah. for a while. This, yeah, so this is Let's go back to basics here. Right, well, but you I'm know what basics was two Lomo Saltados. Yeah, we should add some. We should think about a couple fun things, give the wheel a, a facelift, maybe even yes. change the color. Yeah, we had didn't we have a wheel one day that made us get international foods like that? Yeah, was, right. So that we'll, was it started that was off. That was a fun. So let's two let's episodes. let's uh, yeah, set your butthole on fire. Uh, yeah, I think the slices should reflect the show and not just inconvenience right. us outside of the right. show. And now people do like to see us tortured. Yeah, but that's on the show. Right. In so, the context of the show, in the, in the uh, the organicness of the show. By the way, my stinky cloud contraption did come. I gave it to Steven. <laughs> so stinky we cloud's be, perfect. That's a maybe perfect Thursday we do stinky show. cloud. Perfect. perfect. If we do Stinky yeah. Cloud and we, we also uh, figure out, uh, oh no, he's shaking his head, no, shaking his head. I can't do Thursday. I'm taping <coughs> on Thursday right after. Yeah. All right. But. So what we should do Thursday at least is we should have everyone bring one good idea for the wheel. Let's rebrand the wheel on Thursday. Okay. Let's give it a facelift. Yeah. Let's right. get it excited. I love I can that. Do Stinky Cloud early next like Monday, Tuesday, whatever. Perfect. But well, can you do that? Because. I'm going to bring an idea that's like good for the group, and somebody else bring an idea for good for the group, and you're going to bring something that destroys somebody's life. Correct. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. But everyone else should bring if something everyone, good. Yeah, right. if everyone but brings then, something good for the group, Ron's then going to bring somebody to destroy, destroy somebody's life, and then we're back to destroy. I life. brought Le Bernard Dan to the. Fucking did I have party. to take you guys? I'm I brought. Actually, I brought the fucking gourmet lunch. To I am it. finally. I have this week and next week, and I am finally like free for a little bit. Yeah. It's yes. this week Close. with the with the Barcelona Invitational Friday. Molly Meatball Saturday. Next week we're going Maction Tuesday and Wednesday. After that, wait, is that next week or the week yeah, after? Next week. Okay. After that, your boy's got a little bit of time on his hands, so we'll be doing Lay by in Arden. We'll be. I won't miss any yaks. I'm excited to have. We're almost at the end of football season. Yeah. Not really. Not really, but the, football, but the though. but the filming of all the shows. College football is what. Once college football ends, my schedule greatly opens up. So December's nice. Thank you to Morgan and Morgan. You want to spin it, TJ? Can we put we'll, yeah, they sponsor we'll, the wheel? So. Yeah, we'll do a, a facelift. Almost at Tato back on there or no? Yeah, the way, if the wheel if the wheel is mad, it will go wet right now. And the oh, wheel's fine. Oh, oh, yeah. oh. oh no. Nope. Um so yeah, Thursday everyone bring their best idea and we will I'll think of something fun we can do too that will like be instant wheel. Yeah. That's what's your idea gonna be? 
I don't know. I can't. For some reason, I'm having a hard time getting over this. Did this get longer? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got shorter. Never Look at mine. Like, never <laughs> been like this. This one's awful today. They did a bunch of Look at changes. You. Mine's like jabbing there. KB if, Sass, I, if, if I don't sit Francis all the way over Francis broke here. the one that was in there. So. Oh, Francis well, broke Well, you it. and Francis combined broke it over time. Is Francis the one that was smoking weed and broke his nail, too? Mm-hmm. I've heard that. Huh. That's so funny how, like, uh, buttoned up everybody's been over that, like... <laughs> Pretty obvious, like, or we could just like talk about it, but everyone's who, like, "Who do you think did it?" We can't fucking do it. Tico, Texas, dude. Obviously, yeah, what the yeah, fuck yeah. are we talking yeah, about? Yeah, it was very like, why is everyone like, "Oh, we racist, racist of you?" I mean, I, wit- I witnessed it. I saw it, and I still didn't say anything. Yeah, no, I mean, it was. It was like, "Oh no, we can't. We we probably shouldn't say." <laughs> why? Said, yeah. Why? Everybody yeah. else like. <laughs> Sorry for partying. We like micro said it. Yeah. Who smokes backwards and has like <laughs> a broken nail? Could have been Clummer. Could have been Clummer. <laughs> Clummer smokes fucking Dutch Masters, though. Everybody knows yeah. that he smokes Dutchies. How was everyone's weekend otherwise? You went to Houston? Yes. Um, awful city, to be honest. Yeah. It's the, yeah. Worst. It's the worst. What a what a soulless. So what's wrong with Houston? Place? It ain't walkable, for sure. It's not walkable. There's First service. First off, roads. you come in and it's just a. Dystopia of interstates weaving through each other. Then you Stacked see the up. you see the the horrendous skyline from a distance, lifeless, just blank geometry. <laughs> and then you get there, and it's there's nothing. The downtown is is dull. It's it's no identity, no life. Like people don't live there. Like people. There's live no one there. walking around. There's no energy. Yeah. Yeah. When there's we went, restaurants the- closed on Saturday and Sunday. What? That's their thing. What? The huh. days were when people tend to eat out. <laughs> we went That's for so Super Bowl a few years ago, and I remember downtown wasn't great. The area we were was kind of cool, and we had like a good setup at the bar. The bar we were at was awesome, and the people were nice. But yeah, the downtown, I was just like, what? Yeah, some downtowns are like that, though. Yeah, where it's just like, it's what not, is that? That should yeah. be like the city center, though. Right. Right. The rich folk live um, out of town, yeah. uh, outside of the downtown, right. in like developments, and they want land and little mansions and shit. shit like that. So that's just not downtown. Hmm. Hmm. Did anything like did anybody really stand out to you when you guys were like, doing man on the street or like now everybody's just drunk? Um, oh, you were drunk. Yeah, I was. I was <laughs> sick and drunk, which is a great combo. Terrible combo. I got. Did that st- happen? Yeah, I'm gonna die doing these videos. <laughs> Yeah, but they're oh, yeah, very the funny. It's t- it's too much for me. Yeah, <laughs> sensory overload. Well, I mean, it's only major sports, so you don't have to do anything. It's crazy how they always win when we go. It's crazy, the, yo. Since yeah. like, why since we they... started sending KB and Nick, it was the Super. They're Bowl. always losing. The Rams losing. They end up winning. Kansas, yeah. Kansas getting blown out the first half. End up winning. And then the Astros. Yeah. So they're three and zero now. Look at you, St. Peter's. I accidentally. <laughs> Pick them to win. Accidentally. Oh, you look good. And Fasoli was the best. Were you just drunk because people just were handing you shots? And no, stuff? like I thought I can't do anything like that activity without being drunk. Oh, you have right. to be drunk. Okay. Why? Like, like that's like my least favorite thing in the world. Just go up to strangers. Like yeah, talking yeah. to strangers, interviewing yeah. strangers. So why do you do it? What? Uh, there's career benefits to it. I mean, they're funny. The videos are funny. They're funny. Yeah, but it's you shouldn't do it if you it. hate it. I do truly hate it. So, so you, um, so yeah, I do. There's do a lot it. of things that you should still do despite not liking. Like what? School. 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 Treat dentist. Kids, treat your family yeah. right. <laughs> I was, was going to say yeah. high, teeth hygiene. No one likes yeah. to brush their teeth. No, that's my bad. least favorite part of the day. I've been getting into. I've been really getting into brushing my tongue. I've been watching videos of people power washing uh, carpets, and I try try to do the same thing with oh, my tongue. Oh, dude! I try to fucking yeah. light. Let me my get on that. Up. Washing, watching the. I got a pool guy. I watch those videos. Really? What do you mean? Those are awesome. Where the pool's like black with muck, and by yeah, and he comes I see in. That. And he just yeah. haven't seen those. Oh my yeah. god. Those They're sound addicting. awesome. Those carpet, carpet cleaners. The you know, carpet videos don't really awesome. make sense though, because why are people? They bring in a carpet that's yeah. covered in like tar. Yeah, but they like, oh, it it's always like, I got this rug from a coal shop. Yeah, yeah. Jet yeah. black. Yeah, it's like, or, yeah. Buy a how new many rug? coal shops are there? <laughs> the dude I follow finds them in dumps, like, goes to the dump to find, like, digs out old rugs. Why does he do that? Fixes them, he resells them. And it's I think like, they're expensive as out. hell. They're like yeah, yeah. three dollars like, for a carpet. And it's like, wh- why? How is it that expensive? Oh, it was from a coal store. Yeah, I saw this. Yeah. Where, the, where are these coal where stores? Coal? I thought you meant coals. How long does it take? 
thought. How long does it take to clean a pool that's really, really you, dirty? Yeah, search. Wait, that was red? I don't believe oh, it was awesome. that black. No, I don't either. Search that's false. on Instagram, MJ the pool pro. If that's what the carpet looked like inside the store, then like the store is, should not be a thing. I thought, how did he I, know that it would be there? a great yeah. carpet? <laughs> like, is, is the coal question? store in the mines? Yeah, where? where, <laughs> where, where, where the, how is it getting that coaly? Can we look up what is a coal store now? Hey, now? Well, what did he do? He broke it. He just took away the carpet. No, no. It's good. so look how dark that is, dude. That's it's pitch black. Yeah. That's uh, that was pre. It was almost like a nice black. These it was are better th- black. No, these are very, not, they're very nice carpet either. Is that a Drake? It's kind of ugly. It might have looked better logo? black. You guys are right. Wow, it's not a nice carpet. I don't think bird? you know is what a owl? nice carpet is, though, Sess. I'm just saying the design. But what what would you like as a design for a oh, carpet? Oh, this. Be I get into this. Twenty four yeah. hours. That's it. That's all this guy needs. He shocks it. He's like, all right, first we shock it with this. So we, you know we got to oxidize. It kills all the bacteria. Yeah, and then it all floats. Mm-hmm. The algae floats to the bottom, shocks it again. I love these videos. It's a very oh, bizarre look at it. thing. Open it, it up down there. Look there at goes. this. What? Yeah. What? Wow. It kills all the algae and it drops to the bottom. I like that. Look oh. at that. Oh. Look at that. Bam. Wow. How does a pool pro? How do you? How does a pool get that? Shout dirty. out my guy. It's pretty easy if they don't go with the that chlorine like, treatments. That just has natural just water. Right these there. owners are going to go right back to their old ways. Yeah, yeah right. probably. But then they can just bring MJ the pool pro mm-hmm. back. Mm-hmm. You see the girl who like goes into like the up homes of uh, like recluses who are don't. And they're just disgustingly trash. She cleans she them cleans up free. Them. Yes, there they are. What? Just yep. covered in grime and trash. People. Bugs. Oh God. So bugs. Yeah. That's crazy. Hey, are you guys any you guys Toby Keith fans? Oh, uh, uh, post uh, nine, uh, nine, he had a run post nine eleven. I'll put my boot up your we're ass. All, we all gathered the around. To it. Did um, me. we were at a steakhouse on Friday and he was doing he was like just guest singing with the band. Or is it Jeff Ruby's? Yeah, huh. and so, I was like, uh, yeah, it, su- it sucked because I just don't. I'm not a Toby Keith fan. Yeah, it would have been so cool if it was someone I was a fan. Of. You just suck then. I guess I do. But he it's had some like, cancer too. Yeah, he did. Mm. Keith did. Yeah, but he was singing. He was singing. Uh, he did like a whole set with the band. That's cool. Yeah, it was cool, but it wasn't. Yeah, it, it was been cool, but it wasn't cool. Yeah, because I was like, I don't. How much do you think he got? For before the American Three, Way, before that song, he was really good. Like the I want to be a cowboy or should have been a cowboy. That shit was great. Yeah, nineties he was incredible. And then he got Walmart. Yeah, what happened with Walmart? No, he just he turned into like. Oh, he got mainstream. Yeah. N- Corny. He sold out. Yeah, corny. He wasn't corny in the nineties. He he wrote actual country songs that were good. What's yeah. another one besides that one? I'm trying to think. Uh should have been a cowboy. Besides that one. Um he wrote uh I Wanna Talk About Me and he wrote uh Oh, that's a good talk one. Talk about you. No, he wants to um How do you like me now? Oh, yeah. that song's yeah. so good. How do you like me now? Oh, that's that's a great song. Yeah. Yep. I don't know any of these. How do you like me now? How do you like me? Like me? If you heard that song, you've seen it. You've been like, "How do you like, do you like now? me now? Now that I'm on my, my way, you still, still think, think I'm crazy, crazy. Standing, standing here today? today. You nothing? Could've I know the rock been. song. How you like me now? What? How you like me now? <laughs> yeah, you know that, that was one. like on a, a like a yeah, it's in like a Dodge always, commercial. Yeah. <laughs> that was the rock. How you like me now? No, I said the rock, like a rock song, oh. rock and roll. It's by the Heavy, I believe. Yeah, it's a good song. You guys don't know that song? No. Really? Mm. It's in the what's it called? It's in the fighter. The song we said was much bigger than that yeah, song. Yeah, yeah. You think? Toby mm-hmm. Keith, yeah, mm-hmm. is a big time star. Mm-hmm. That's a pretty big song. It just sucked because I don't. I should have been more like into it, but I'm. I guess I'm not. I've never yeah. been. A no, you shouldn't. You owe Toby Keith. You should. No, no, you really don't though. But isn't that a cool thing? And they, like everyone was like, "This is awesome," and I was like, well, I "How don't... big was the steakhouse?" There was probably. 300 people in that like main area just a bunch of rich people eating steak after yeah going very stuff. rich people but i think if we lost all of our money and we went to like uh applebee's b- less than that oh. on saturday Bob Evans? which was sad no it was like a, it's called lexington live which was just basically a cafeteria hall mm-hmm. so it was a, a stark contrast bad news guys what <coughs> the other song is more popular. No. no. Yeah. Do it, Sass. I was always with you, really? Sass. Like 50 million more streams. Can we listen, can we listen to 10 seconds of it, please? Well, who, what's you guys, what, who, who, you guys what's know the this other song? one. I'm sure I know it. I just. Yeah, I do know it. 
This is a pretty pop. It's in like a lot of ten seconds. Movies. But that's the only part of it I know. I don't know any of the rest of that song. But I will say also, if you look up "How Do You Like Me Now," the Toby Keith song does come up. First. Oh. Yes. But in terms of streaming, this one has more. Oh yeah, I know oh, this song very well. Yeah. Oh like yes, okay. Yeah, okay. There yeah. was a time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, that's Fair a enough. good song. Yep. I think the fact that Toby Keith is playing at steakhouses is kind of the proof that you, uh, the you man don't has need had like cancer it. and is trying to come back. And he, he was at he was at the Breeders' Cup, so obviously he's very rich and famous, and he mm-hmm. was there doing rich and famous things, and is trying to bounce back. What do you want? Are where you were related you, to him? Wanted to die of cancer? Why are you trying to take up for well, Toby Keith? Die because I Toby Keith was very important to my childhood. Oh, I enjoyed nice. uh, when I was growing up in the '90s as a poor. Young person in Mississippi, I liked his music. Yeah. I'm just saying it's the voiceless. It contextualizes yeah. why Big Cat doesn't like him. That's all I'm saying. That I mean, Big Cat said he didn't like him. I just, said he just, I just don't know. I'm not a country him. guy. Exactly. Never because he's not that big. Well, I am a country guy. So if we're going to bring up country, I'm right. going to represent for my people. Okay. Uh, I was in Lexington, Kentucky. Oh, nice. The Breeders' Cup. It was very fun until it wasn't fun because we lost everything. Oh, Friday man. looked incredible. It was one of those things, and I know that this is um, probably loser talk, but. I'm a born loser. Friday, Friday we won everything. Like, Dave was up like a hundred thousand. I was up like twenty k. It was incredible. We went to the steakhouse. We had like it was like a Goodfellas type dinner. It was like a four hour dinner, just laughing. Who was there? Who was the, who was at the dinner? It was me, Elio, Jerry, Silvana, Dave, uh, one of Silvana's friends, and then another horse guy. And we like Mike Rapoli was coming over. Oh, you know, we keep to say oh. it was like that's awesome. Wouldn't have been a better scene. <laughs> <laughs> laughing, yeah. we're never gonna lose another bet yeah. again. Uh, and then we lost literally every single <laughs> bet on Saturday. So, but I have that memory. That one night. Where everything was great. That was game three of the World Series yeah. for me. It's Dave was, like, oh, we're up 7 nothing. We're Dave fucking was a, hitting the, home runs. Yeah, right, pitch. exactly. There was a contest that, like, everyone, like, all the um, super rich, like, Kenny Maines in it, Bobby Flays in it, all these people are in this contest. Oh. Dave was in second in the entire contest. Uh, and so everyone was coming up to him being like, second place, that's crazy. And then. What do you finish at? It, bankrupt. Jesus. Yeah, bankrupt. <laughs> we lost everything. That sucks. We lost everything. That blows. And the 5K, you got your 5K back. At least yeah, that was crazy. Wait, you just walked away, like you just kind of forgot? Oh, it works at a uh, track, so there's tellers that you can go up to, the people that you can make your bets with, or there's machines. I like to use the machines because I like to play around. It was 10 a.m. because it was like we were out all night Friday, 10 a.m., very quick turnaround, brain was foggy, put in my voucher for 7K, made a bet for 2K, and just walked away. Oh. And then, like, five minutes later, I was like, I just walked away from that. And then I went back to the machine and started pressing all the machines. <coughs> Some guy was like, hey, did you leave your voucher? And I was like, yeah. He's like, how much? I was like, 5K. He's like, all right, I got it. Like, unbelievable. God. I mean, how, wh- who does that? That guy's an incredible human being. Incredible. It was a free $5,000 for him, right? Yeah, and I, g- I gave him a $500 bet on, a, uh, on the next race he lost. Mm. So I gave him nothing. Damn. Yeah, it was, I mean... All time good guy move. Did you see that fucking girl in Lexington who just like, oh god, she, what she broke like she had like a PR for most n words said in one. Oh no, oh, yeah. her. Her. that was it's over that for her. She's out of here, and she has his. She has priors. Oh, she has priors. I didn't know that. Yeah, on film, just that was fucking what? terrible. Where, the woman when she were, was attacking showed so much restraint. It was like Saturday night. So much. I don't think we should play the video. No, no, we're not no, playing no, the video. No. You could play the video from last year where she was like talking oh. about. Damn. She, Trashing some kid for his, uh, she was almost SES ce- celebratory in the way she was saying it. Yeah, she looks cocky in her mugshot too. I didn't watch Little it, but bitch. I think I know she's yeah. like they're like yeah. You thought it was a funny video, didn't you? No, I was <laughs> like I don't need to see this. Yeah, yeah was, why not? It was bad. It was painful to watch. Uh, yeah, I just don't yeah. need to see a white girl saying the M word like yeah. a thousand times. Yeah, she, maybe a reminder that it's still the racism still alive. You yeah. should be vigilant yeah. at all, all angles. You guys notice anything like different about me today? Mm. Are you wearing ma- man's banks? Are you wearing? I was gonna ask. Oh, are you? Oh, yeah. You kind of noticed it. Really? Yeah. I kind of so, I kind of notice it. <laughs> Dude, they're so official. Look at you this. Look Wait, so what? Full body. It's so no. Just, Seventy-five degrees it's, outside. It's so tight. <laughs> I can't. I can't put it on. You have to put it on like a dress. Yeah. You gotta be you sweating your ass off. <laughs> oh damn. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Oh, it's a tank top. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I have to literally take it on and off like 
<laughs> going to the bathroom must be a nightmare. <laughs> What is going it? to the bathroom must be insane. Aren't you supposed to do the full long sleeve no, 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 to accentuate no, the shoulders and biceps? No, I think you want the shoulders and biceps to be popping, right? Popping Would out. that make them pop? No, I think it makes them pop more when I wear like a Fine. thermal underneath. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Are oh, you going to bring it up far enough? You look like, like a singlet. Yeah, you do look like, look like a singlet. <laughs> no, bro. Wrestle oh, his shit. ass, KB. Oh, no. <laughs> you got to be hot in that. No, I'm not hot at all. <laughs> <laughs> Do you yeah. feel confident? You feel oh, more feel confident? So you did look That's lean today. You look very lean. I thought it was a haircut. I bought so many more of these, too. I'm just going to wear them every day now. <laughs> Albert Lean. I feel lean. I can't recommend yeah. it enough, Brandon. <laughs> Why me? Because you have titties like me. There. Your legs, your Start stems are crazy today. I started, I've started working out this morning. I did weightlifting. It is a little emasculating, though, to have to put on a <laughs> singlet that's like a dress every morning. But guess what? I don't care because I look good now. Yeah, you look good. What the fuck? I kind of, I kind of ruined the whole purpose of it by taking my shirt off there. But yeah, whatever. We'll keep that. Just keep that between me and the yak listeners. No one say anything. Everyone act cool. Yeah, you gotta be excited about that. Oh, I feel so good. Peeling that thing off. I went. I wore it to the steak dinner too, and it was like I ate a lot, but I didn't feel bloated. Gross. Yeah. But you had won all your bets. You were eating great steak. Spanked up, or spanked up like that. That might have been peak you. It was, it was truly an incredible night that I'll just remember forever, and then lost everything. Now you kind of get to experience the satisfaction at the end of the day of like uh, when a woman takes their bra. Yes, yes. It's it's yeah, very it, very nice when I take it off at the end of the day, like long hard day, of just sucking in my gut, spilling out after. <laughs> It's like the first thing I do as soon as I get in my door every day. It's I like fling it across the room and sometimes I forget and I'll have been home for like four hours and I remember it's on and I'm like, son of a bitch, I'll never get those four hours back without this fuck. Yeah, it's mm, terrible. Totally. It does yeah. suck. But it totally. is a nice feeling to. There's nothing worse than going, to, going out for the day and something uncomfortable. Yeah. And then you get home and you take it off and you're like, now I feel good. What have you ever had like that? I don't know. You wear like an uncomfortable sweatshirt oh, or a shirt. I know what you're saying. Like I wear pants some days, and I'm like, I probably should have wore shorts today. And but Sass wears the same thing every day. It just ruins your whole day. No, you wear like bad a bad point. pair of pants, or you wear a bad t-shirt, and you're like, this t-shirt's making me look real fad. Trent calls them soft clothes. Right? It's like you when you get home from church on Sunday, and you're all wearing those, un- and then it's football time. You all put on your sweats, and you're wearing mm-hmm. comfy clothes. Oh, that was a great feeling. feeling. That is a good feeling. Rushing upstairs just to change. Got away with church. just dressing like that all all the time, yeah. comfortably. You wore that shit at church. When I go to church, when you were so going, when, to, when you were going to church, yeah, I would, yeah, I would, you could you could get away with it. It's kind of slobby, yeah. There's a little sloppy. You sit in the back though, slink up for your. The, the, the important part is being there, right? Mm-hmm. Receiving bomb, receiving communion. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, you've you've renounced the church. No, God doesn't care By what you wear. No means. By no means. By no means. No means. What? What is the? You know what? Do you ever uh, <laughs> touch cross paths with the the jockeys of the game? Ah, uh, not really. The no horse guys. Like you ever? What are they? What are they up to? They're just. They're weird. But they're like superstars though in that world. They are. They definitely talk yeah. like this. Yeah. They're definitely up here. But they're so voice. small and they're just. They, they have are. groupies, right? That's yeah. Got to be a. Thing. Oh, for sure. Yeah. They got baddies, bro. They definitely have baddies. Absolutely have yeah. baddies. There's got to be like a bar where they all hang out. Like I want to know where they hang out. Like, I do too. Their, I want to yeah. be there, and yeah. I want to be amongst them. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you want to be a giant. Yeah. You want to start a fight at a jockey bar. <sighs> you would have liked it, KB. The maybe the the greatest horse of all time braced uh, on Saturday. Beautiful animal. It's just very. Yeah. Is, is he being lauded as such? Uh, he is now retired. Flight line. Incredible horse. What's special about him? He was like the fastest horse ever. He beat everyone by like a million. Huh. Well, how come time. he never won a derby? He got hurt right before the Kentucky Derby and was like a slow starter. Well, he was a pussy. He's six, six for six. Six races, won all six. We well, missed a potentially great horse. Unfortunately. It's yeah. actually sad. Wow. It is. Retired? I wish he didn't Josh retire. Gibson. But he retires and now his, his cum is worth like Very good reference. a year. Josh, That's Josh Gibson. Gibbs. Josh Gibson. Lucas Dupree. Yeah. Well, he had his chance, though. Josh yes, there never was. Do they let those horses, like, fuck? Or is it all just oh, manual? Yeah. Is it? No, all- I think it's manual. Yeah, that's the Oh, no, no. I thought they had a teasing stallion come in, get the girl ready, and then they bring him in and just... And just I, I don't think... Do some manual, but there's some fucking going on. I think it's manual because I think it's... 
it's like they don't want them to get injured in any way. Or if you spill the seed prematurely, it's like that's a waste of some right. thick good cum. A lot of money. You sell that I shit. I think there's some fucking. They gotta let them they have some. They gotta something. let them have some. Yeah, you'd think. I mean, it's still gotta feel good. <clears throat> to get jerked off? Yeah, by a random dude. That's weird. That's a weird thing. Why? Cum is cum. <laughs> cum is cum. Like, do you think the horse is thinking, like, as they're coming, like, oh, fuck, this dude is weird. Why is he stroking me? <laughs> you think I think they might use a flashlight, actually. He might get excited when he sees the guy coming. I'm pretty sure they use, like, the, like a huge flashlight, and then it just, like, goes into a, a, a big, Oh, yeah, because like, you wouldn't want to have to touch the cum, or even... Uh, well, yeah, because then if... Yeah, like, you don't wanna, that's expensive. You don't want to sully the cum. It's expensive cum. I wonder how often they get to. There's probably dudes who are really nice at it that the horses really like. There's <laughs> nice probably touch. guys that can like really like softly milk the cum from the horse that are like mm. probably incredible at it. I do think there's more horse sex than you think. I don't think it's all manual. I don't think with these horses though. These horses are like they're, that the story they're they were, so expensive. There's horses that are called teasing stallions that come in, get the girl revved up, and then the the Maybe. stud horse just walks in, fucks her. But I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I actually, I'm, I'm. What does a teasing stallion do? It's a whore. It's a whore horse. Yeah, it gets, Can it, you look this up, TJ? It gets, it gets it gets the girl in the mood. I don't know how it works, but they're, they 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 it works. That's crazy. That would be a shitty life, dude. I saw that in. Uh, it's not so bad. In seventeen seventy six, two percent of the, the uh, people in Manhattan were prostitutes. Wow. Two percent. One in every fifty per person was pro a prostitute wow. in Manhattan. Wow. Two percent of everyone in Manhattan. That's so much prostitutes. That's so many prostitutes. That's a lot of Johns. And they were all That's in the a lot same. Of guys. Mm -hmm. Well, I think it was right when the Continental Army came to uh, New York, and mm -hmm. they were just fucking. They were fucking. It was their first time out of their home state, so they were just out fucking. No teasing stallions. Arriving mares are in estrus and receptive to a stallion. You think in the old west there were as many hookers as there are in old west shows? Yes. Yes. Because I would say in those old west towns, like forty percent of the people seem to be hookers. It's the oldest industry, right? There's no woman in an old west show that isn't a hooker. Does anyone want McDonald's? Mike just asked. What? Why? I don't know. Oh, come on, Mike. It's Monday, dude. We're trying to be we're sharp. All good. I mean, oh, yeah, I do. I have fish today. Dude. I do, but I can't. Oh. I You're can't just, he's stiffly. He's sniffly. Sniffly, bro. Mm -hmm. He's got the sniff back on the fruit. Yeah, go pee. Go pee. You, you still got it? Bitch. What? The cold? Yeah, I said it. I got the sniffles. This is my first day having them. I woke up this oh. morning just real sniffly. I was on my flight, and did, when your nose is leaking on a flight, oh, yeah. you, I ran out of tissues before we even took off. I had to like improvise. I was using my backpack. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. Start, yeah. I had to use oh. the safety manual. Yeah, <laughs> I'm in yeah. the middle, and I don't want to like... Yeah. I, don't, I was trying to think. I can't like use my hand or shirt. That seems to be the grossest option, but the other options are... I think you got to go hand at some point. My walk or you just keep No, you flip your shirt and inside out i was just and do it and then you flip it back <sighs> is if you're desperate enough what about the same tissue i was reusing it and that gets it was like yeah, it gets <laughs> bad <laughs> oh, for yes. my, and the, the lady next to me she was I, she would not fall asleep i know she was looking <laughs> i was in her peripherals oh, especially because uh, people are still kind of on edge like people are like right i don't yeah. care about covid but if you're on the plane and you're sniffling and sneezing people get mad but you couldn't go to the bathroom and get a stack i was in the middle i just like i yeah the long flight Houston is a no. that is very a layover in Atlanta. I had two flights with the same thing going on. Ugh. Yeah, because last ticket out, they're giving you that middle seat. You're getting bitch row. Uh -huh. I was bitch rowed up. But at the same time, like, you have to go get some paper towels. But I could tell you didn't because you your nose would have been chafed to kingdom come. Dude. Yeah. You would have had some chafage underneath. That's a, that is another yeah. thing. Jerry Schaefer. Going for the backpack is a wild move. <laughs> that is Rubbing wild it on move. my Jan Sport. Yeah. <laughs> Ew, dude. Can we see we, your back trails? Yeah, because there are any little snail trails on it? It looks like a horse just came in it. When I go, when I'm in that position, I go, I go hand to sock. Hand to sock. sock. Oh. Yeah. You shouldn't be in that position <laughs> ever. I don't think. I don't think it's ever acceptable to be in that position. Brother, you should have seen me on the walk here. Buy tissues though. Spraying from the nose. Just buy tissues. At any of the bodegas in New York. There's literally a bodega every I feel like block. there's something even more gross about than you pulling up to work and just emptying out all the tissues from your pocket. Oh, that's more yeah. gross? Cleaning your Also, nose. yeah, Houston, like, no stores. I was, like, walking for 20 minutes. Couldn't find a store.
You know what I'm talking about? Like a store? Yeah. They don't have any. Like a bodega. There's no. Something like that. Like 7 Eleven bodega. They don't have that. No. No. You have to go to the, like, uh, the more Mexican prominent areas to get any kind of any kind of juice. They probably have more stores out there. They probably have decent food, walkability, and yeah, community. Yeah, I'm not judging the city as a whole. Um, but like, I, I should have. I went to some, the. Yeah, I've never eaten a, at a Sonic before, but I I got a Sonic when I got. Sonics are so good. It was dope. Sonic is very like good. That. Had what a burger. It was. Oh, Whataburger is real good. Equivalent of a Burger King cheeseburger. Whataburger is so Maybe. overrated. I didn't. I really? was just right down the. Oh no. What are you eating? Are you just come back eating? I said Whataburger is overrated to me. Here's my problem with Whataburger. Everyone says you got to get the chicken. You hate Texas. No, no, no. no I no. like Whataburger, but no, I also no, like it's burger fine. But when you say a burger place, you got to get the chicken. What's up with that? The burgers are terrific. Yeah, but everyone says the chicken is the best. Who says that? Everyone. They're assholes. Literally everyone. It was a Nestle Crunch bar. I got the uh I got the jalapeno burger at Sonic and uh it was just like a regular burger with jalapenos on it. It's pretty good. Sonic's got good burgers. Sonic is very location dependent. Like it, 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 is. it has the most inconsistent or the most yeah. Especially with variety yeah, of it's, it's quality. Yeah, we were in like a East Texas oil field. Depends on who's staffing the. I have a New Jersey Sonic I go to in Hasbro Heights, and their burgers are fine, but their tater tots are poor. Mm. Tater tot poor. All tater tots are poor. No, no, tater tots are delicious. But nah, bro. They're the, actually, I think the worst way of serving a potato. Oh, I love tots. I would agree with me that. Back in the old man. Big tot lady. Definitely. The worst way of serving a potato. Yeah, you're telling it's me. almost impossible for them to be good because they're always pre-frozen. They That's have it. to be pre-frozen in a way that makes them naturally bad. Tell me, tater tots French are the worst way to do a potato. Of course, French yes. fries are pre-frozen too, but you can heat a French fry through well enough. Tater tots are better than French fries. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Mm. I think that not um, even close. Your touch is so I much more consistent across the board. But since it is a personal opinion thing, I'll allow you to have yeah, that. Yeah, if, if, lo- takes- if loaded tater tots are on the menu, I'm going with that over got the fries. To. Over curly got fries. To. I don't. Yeah, over curly fries. I think the steak fry is the worst. If I get to a place and they have fries tater. and tater tots, I'm ordering the tater tots 100 percent of the Your time. Your child. You gotta I'm request not. that they're crispy. Yeah, you are. They gotta be crispy. They don't have to be. The crispy. child move. No, they do. Nah, bro. That shit is fucking. That shit is poor. Tater tots, nah. I love tater tots. Nah. You were just yes on tater tots. Nah. Switch arguments half for listening. I was half listening. Now that I'm fully listening, you just nah. once you found out who was on which side, you no, 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 no. I listen. Tater tots are fine, but I'll never take tater tots over fries. That's psycho. If you're at a place, tater that tots has, over chips, yeah. If you're at a place that has tater tots and fries, I guarantee you their tater tots are better. They don't have great fries. Uh, Why else would they have tater tots? Go like sweet potato fries, regular fries, tater tots, chips. You go sweet potato like fries mouth. over all everything. Yeah, I love sweet potato fries. Too. I don't like love the mouthfeel of tater tots when they when I get into them, and oh, yeah. I often That's find so that their heat is a mouthfeel is uh, inconsistent. They're either too hot or uh, too cold, or too crispy at the edges, or you know, I don't think that there's. Hey, Toby Keith, you hate tater tots. Me? Oh, this one. This one? You wouldn't last five minutes in the South, big cat. I don't hate Toby. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to get fat. You wouldn't be able to. Get, you're not racist enough. Like you would not last five minutes down there. I. I don't hate Toby Keith. I just am not a fan because music is subjective. I never was a country fan. That's hate. Steven's gearing up for a take. I agree with Brandon that Tater Tots are very good, but you can't say, you can't use your main argument as they're consistent everywhere and you just said the <coughs> Tater Tots by you at the Sonic were poor. Wow. Wow. He's the, apart, he he lawyered one. you. Was that, was that a gotcha that was necessary? Mm-hmm. I, I agree with you. I think Tater Tots are very good. He's a slave to semantics. All right. Thank you, Stephen. You're welcome. Call a crackhead. <laughs> Next time you're in trouble, call a crackhead. <laughs> what the hell is that? That, uh... What the hell are you talking you about? You stare me down. He's like a politician. He's like, if you think all cops are bad, the next time you're in trouble, call a crack. <laughs> <laughs> he's, I, yeah, he's good. Whoever that is. Who is it, Fetterman? It's probably fucking Fetterman. I wasn't ass. Fetterman because that's a, that's a right-leaning thing to say. I know. That Florida I'm sheriff oh, that's always in the news. Like always saying crazy shit. There's I don't know who. Oh, yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah. In the news. Yeah. yeah. He's fantastic. So the election. Bro, can I ask College. a question? This is a little awkward for you. Is it about Fetterman wearing soft clothes? No. Oh yeah, the the other one was Doctor Oz. You see, Doctor Oz is like before, you, like call ten people before the Steelers game on Sunday, and they were on a bye week. 
Yeah, oh, he said yeah, that. Yeah, politicians talking sports is always the funniest. Yeah. Violent crime is surging <laughs> in Louisiana. <clears throat> Woke leaders blame the police. Oh, it's John Kennedy. I blame yeah. the criminals. Oh, it's a mom should not have to look over her shoulder when she's pumping gas. I voted against the early release of violent criminals. And His makeup is hilarious. The way he said against. Police. Also, this look, guy. Look, if you hate cops just because they're cops, the next time you get in trouble. Call a crackhead. <laughs> <laughs> that rules. This guy also was just built in a lot. Like, I think he woke up one day and looked in the mirror and was like, yeah, I should be a politician. It's time for me to be a politician. <laughs> well, that's an accent I just have never heard. <laughs> oh, Louisiana's different. Louisiana, again, Louisiana has the best accents because they have so many of them. Yeah. You ever see the Herman Cain political ad? Which one? It was supposed to be kind of artsy, and it's just cops. him smoking a the cigarette time behind a get- building. Oh, look up the Herman Cain cigarette political ad. It's one of the most. The next time things. you get in trouble, call a crackhead. <laughs> crackhead. crackhead. How many Great takes you think he had of that? But he had thirty. Yeah, they're call like just crackhead. freestyle this one. <laughs> crackhead. Uh, call a said, prostitute. Call a hook. Everything was southern there until he said the word against, and then he went all against. Canadian. Against. Against. It's kind of British sounding. Against. 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 Yeah. But somebody. Against. Did. Sound like Jericho. Call a crackhead. Since January, I've had the privilege of being an <laughs> assistant manager of Godfather's oh, Pizza at 744 Indiana Boulevard. What's and operating salad bar wait, chef of a franchise in the successful yeah. restaurant business once headed by it. Herman Cain. Tomorrow, it's one day closer to the White House. I really believe that Herman Cain will put the cane back in the United States of America. Oh and my. if I didn't believe that, <laughs> I would have quit last week when Sean spit in my Diet Dr. Pepper. We've so made pizza joke. the light. Hey, this is right one. Oh, yeah. There is uh, one where it's like real artsy, and it's just him. It's literally just him smoking a cigarette, and it's a real ad. It's just there's. Like, I don't think there's words. I think it just like slowly zooms in on him as he does a thousand yard stare, and he rips the heater, and it's like a real. Anyway, I don't really built that one up. It's kind of dope, though. Highly recommend fun yeah. at some point. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, all a crackhead. All a crackhead. Yeah, all a crackhead. How did you know about that one? It's all over. I haven't seen yeah. it. Yeah, that's been around for a long time, I feel like. Yeah. Or at least I don't have that saying, right? Also, Kyle's oh, frame of reference is like a gerrymandered district, dude. It just like has tentacles out into the wildest uh, places. He has a crazy frame of reference. Yeah. Maybe best frame of reference in the office, dude. Maybe good. broadest frame of reference. Well, he didn't even know how to spell, say, Yakima. 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 No, nobody know how to say that. You going to cheat uh, uh, tomorrow night that doesn't? I can. Mm-hmm. You will. Who's the teams again? Uh, me, you, and Steven. You guys against Smokin? We are? We're teaming up? Should we're, we get our faces painted like sad clowns? We're against the Honkers, and then the Frankettes are against Chicago. Oh, speaking of which, our guy on uh, Hendrix Johnson did another, I think, 10X celebration. He scored again? Oh, and I'm going to send it to TJ. He said, I, knew, I had to do it because I knew you had a big game against Smokin this week. <laughs> Fuck yes, dude. Oh, he scored. Yeah, good for him. He just get he's just getting mad touchdowns. Dude, are know. people flaming you right now because of you saying that Houston sucked? Oh no. Oh, I I don't know. I don't know. Um the, the, well, you should only care about what I say about the people. Right, the people of Houston were very nice. I I oh, did was not the enjoy city the planner. service the service roads or whatever the fuck they're called. Yeah, I think Houston was, yeah. people probably agree with that. Look at this. Let's see. Oh, 10X. Yay. Love it. This guy's a beast. Oh, what? All he does is score. Between the legs? And he wears number 10. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I was like, what's that relation to? You kind of wanted to shit on that for a second. <laughs> the way you looked at Steven, you were like, I'm going to about to No, I, my brain is just very slow right now. So, yeah, that took me a second to realize that 10, 10X. Got it. I hope he's written like an X on his jersey somewhere. I started following the 10X doctor on Instagram. Oh, see, here you go. They're going to be reaching out to you soon they're gonna yeah. try and get you they now. got dave i gotta say i went in with an open mind oh you were just with dave all weekend too uh, oh no no i went in with an open mind and i watched a few videos and i the mind shut right away okay yeah. is dave still doing it i think so he was t- the guy was talking about alkaline 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 water and like mm-hmm. re- you gotta you gotta alkaline charge your body when you go on an airplane you gotta shock your body he said he goes in, into the Every every hour he's on an airplane, he goes into the bathroom and does sixty squats, air squats. How? In, in the bathroom. There's just not room. Right. There's no room for that. He just does it over the toilet, probably. Hmm. 
that he couldn't get high enough. I guess if your legs are engaged the entire time, maybe it works better. Being on an airplane sucks. Why would I want to do that? I can't stand in a bathroom. No. 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 Exactly. I've never been in the first class bathrooms. Are those bigger? Those are huge. <laughs> Gigantic, yeah. You could probably do squats in there. You get to shit probably by the yeah, Listen, probably buddy, if, you, if you have to ask, you can't afford it, <laughs> unfortunately for you. I laid down in the first class bathroom. Last do you guys tip in the first class bathroom? Do you tip the guy that's in there? or is Yeah. It? <laughs> I'll usually tip him with 20 to start just so that uh, that way he won't say anything when I do oh, for when you cocaine come back. during it. Yeah, yeah during yeah. The, my flight. I used to watch those videos of Casey Neistat like taking showers in the first class bathrooms. Mm. Those are like the Emirates across the oh, country. Those, those oh, those are the world flights. Sick. Showers. All right, so I wanted to ask the awkward question to you, um, Roan. Yeah. Are you, on the Pat Bev podcast, are you going to bring up LeBron's just habitual line? It's I was, maybe the I funniest just found out ever. about it, and it's I have his history of it, and it's so funny. It, it is so funny, and it's so harmless. It's something like, I don't that I, actually... it's something that I would probably do. I yeah. used to pretend to like. Yeah, KB is. Th- yeah, you're the main proponent of lying. You're you're yeah. the one who said it's the easiest way to get out of things. Like what? What are All right, some so of the for, lies? So this the one came up because he wore um, the same suit as Takeoff before a game. Who recently tragically passed away, and at, he was asked about it afterwards. And he's like, yeah, I've been a big fan of theirs. I got put onto them in 2010, and they had not released any music. Listen to his answer. Yeah, yeah, he, he was confusing them with um, we gotta listen Travis to Porter. I was listening to those guys when I, my first year with the Heat in 2010. Yeah. And you can ask any one of my teammates back then. They had no idea who the Migos was. They were like cursing me out when I would play it throughout the weight room or play it in the <laughs> locker room. Throwing them under the I was like, I'm tired. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Time, you know, That's like, crazy. Throwing everybody. everybody. Throwing like, Migos yeah. and his teammates. Everyone hated this. So he's got like a kind of a history of doing this. The other one was the Kobe 81 game. If you can find it, it's very funny. What did he it's, say about that? He said like, he I told Kobe. It. He knew I told it. my boy before. before. He, he oh, no. The, 70. the Godfather pretending like it's his favorite movie and not being able to name one scene. Right. Oh. Or he says he, he read a book. He's, he's like, I read this book like six or seven times during the playoffs. Watched, watched the whole game. I seen the whole game. I was at home watching the game. And, you know, I said he was going to, before the game even started, when I seen. Uh, I said he was probably gonna score seven. That's like a Drewski skit. I don't, like, oh, I don't I know said what made that. me say that. And my <laughs> friends was with me, and they was like, okay. So when he I got to like seventy, I, I was like, well, he might as well go for eighty now. So <laughs> I'm a fan of the game, and to see that performance was unbelievable. I watch. It's it, they're all so funny, and they're all just like it's like I said, completely innocuous. Not like he's hurting anyone, but <laughs> and I think it yeah. stems from him wanting to give. Like he wants to like give you a, like a good story or a good answer instead of just being like yeah yeah like yeah. Kobe's great. Also, have yeah. you guys seen the video of him rapping while into the Migos? Well, he never knows the words. To Doesn't song. know any of the words. Can we, TJ? Can you play that? I'm a LeBron hater as well. I will say, I'm not that a LeBron hater. Okay, I'm not. I've, I've never him. liked LeBron. Love He's my him. favorite player. But I will actually defend the Kobe clip because. If you remember during that time, Kobe was going like he scored sixty three maybe in three quarters against the Mavericks, and it was like there was a a solid couple months span. Where Didn't he, he have like, like a, a, a four game. or five game fifty point stretch yes. right there? Yeah. yeah. So saying also, he was going to get seventy against the Raptors. That that's not like a that's not a. Also, I, I just remember that being like on a Sunday, a game nobody was watching, and uh, I just don't think he was watching. <laughs> If you look at both of those clips, when he looks ba- he, when he t- starts referencing the memories, he does look to his right, which is like accessing the memory side of your brain instead of looking to the ah. left, which is accessing the making shit up side of the brain. I watched a couple episodes. Is that for real? Why film that? Oh no, this is pop smoke. But he's done it like a hundred times. I just sent you a couple more, TJ, that are so funny. Because Russ always knows every word, dude. Whenever Russ used to film himself, like, singing and shit, he would know every word of the most obscure songs, and then Brown would try to do it. It is a question uh, not related to the game, but since uh, it has been a lot of publicity uh, yesterday and today about Godfather Part 2, which is the, uh, the scene or... Or the moment, or the phrase, or the quote you like more from the movie? Oh, from The Godfather. Uh, um, it's, 
It's too many different phrases, <laughs> uh, too many different lines in that movie to just uh, categorize one. That's like when they asked uh, Trump what his favorite Bible verse uh, was. Uh, that's that was also wrong. an insane question to ask at the NBA Finals. Why not? Yeah, that's the NBA Finals. They're asking about it's the Godfather. Yeah, yeah, the next yeah, one, TJ. The next one's my favorite. It's yeah. so. I, I had one coach, um, and he used to say, "Put yourself in situations where you're not in, you're not comfortable." Oh yeah, that's my favorite saying. <laughs> I say that all the time. He, he didn't <laughs> even like say the quote correctly. <laughs> What's my favorite saying? I'm oh yeah, I was just that. thinking about that. There's also yeah. one I saw retweeted. That's that, my like, mom. <laughs> Seinfeld 2000 uh, account tweeted LeBron in 2015 and was like, "LeBron, what's your favorite episode of Seinfeld?" He's like, "I'm not even lying. I'm watching it right now." <laughs> he just wants to be liked. Yeah. It's fucking hilarious, though. Yeah, that's my favorite saying. <laughs> I'm always saying that. I've been always saying that. Uh, There's a scene in Godfather 2 where they steal a rug. Yes. I'm gonna bring that shit full circle. You could just uh, be like, take the take, take. There are no leave. Take the cannolis. Leave, leave the gun. Take the cannolis. Yeah. Never saw it. You never. The second one? No, I never saw it. So good. Right? I'm sorry. I never saw Godfather Part 2. Oh, I, saw, I saw The Godfather. You Something. watch movies and TVs like... Yeah. I don't really get into mob movies or anything. Isn't the like second that. one the best one? Yes. I've heard that. That's cool. You should watch it. Yeah, watch I it on a plane. That's fine. Yeah. Watch it when you're up till 3 a.m. one night. Just not clamoring to watch Godfather Part 2. It's a, Can you please watch it? Can you please watch it? It's very good. It's a good movie. It's, it's long. I didn't watch Godfather until like 2014. Like It, it took me a while, but it, it's obviously good. But Can you please watch it? Is that important to you? Yeah, I'd like you to watch it so that we could our bond can be strong. Somebody tell me where it's streaming on. Everywhere. Just Not go everywhere. to AMC any day and I'm sure it's on. The most famous like the most famous. If movie. that's the T V version, I don't want to watch that. Yeah, that's true. Because that is like five hours with the commercials. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and uh yeah, you missed it. maybe the scene at where uh Sonny's or no, that's the Godfather one, of course. Sonny. Oh, that was almost embarrassing. That was. I caught myself. Fredo, I knew it was you. It broke my heart. That was Godfather 1. No, no. No, that's 2. It's 2. It's, so did you see 2? You saw 2. No, I just know that that's They're a, down in that Cuba? is a famous... Uh, that's 2. But that's a famous I'm in line. Rome. That's a famous line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, but the, Fredo betrays him in, in 1, though. No, no. That's 2. Oh no! It's that it's her. Fredo can't protect oh, his that's dad. Oh, one. two! It's the fucking it's it's her it's that girl's husband that betrays. Correct. And gets him killed. That's who. Okay. Yeah. Sonny's husband. There was a betrayal. Spoilers. Okay, so Fredo's part two. But you've already. I've, that's a famous thing. Fredo, Fredo, Fredo. So you hear that? Yeah. So you should. You, you're like, the Fredo of the yak. You should at least know that. And well, that's the N word for us I'm Italians. The, I don't think that I'm the Fredo of the yak. Yeah. Yeah, that is true. Cuomo, when he said, "Don't call me Fredo." It's the N word for Italians. <laughs> I'm glad Nick isn't here to hear that. Everyone throwing around Fredo. He'd go fucking He'd have a connection. Oh, you can't honey. use Jew words now. Nipshin? Yeah. <laughs> Nick aside, bro. <laughs> He'd kvetch. You see them bobbing and weaving through the, uh, oh, so the marathon runners? Oh, so funny. Keep ta people keep tagging him. Keep tagging me, uh, tagging me in that because I want to watch it over and over. Yeah. yeah. We have a Pizza Hut wheel? We have a Pizza Hut wheel. Oh, Ooh. yeah, because we're deciding the person? Yes. So Yak Basketball coming Friday night, Barstool Invitational. Have buy you heard? Tickets. Am I doing the trampoline or not? I, I've i been guaranteeing it, so. I don't think you can. I don't know if the Philadelphia is going to let me do it. I know. Every time, like, Blatman or Hank shakes their head, I'm like, no, no, no. You don't understand. I've guaranteed it. We'll just do it another day. I want to do it then. I want to do it. So we'll do it. Okay. But if we can't do it there. Have you been practicing? No. What about a human I'm trampoline with my what if we did it? on? You could get a little bounce. What, what if we did it, like, after off? the game? Yeah, I mean, I just want to do it. I mean, people are still, I mean, the, the people that work in the arena will still be there. How much time do you think you'll need if you get gravely injured? I'm not worried about the injury. I'm just. Oh, let's go. I mean, that's a trampoline. I don't know why. What, what do you, what did you think I was going to. You got how this. How big do you think I thought it was going to be? Yeah, the, you got this. I eventually got there. All right. I'm going to be there all day Friday, so I will get some trampoline scouting. Are we, uh, are we doing the yak on Friday? I don't know. I doubt it. I mean, we're all going, right? What time does yeah. the bus leave? There's a bus. No. The bus is like 11. I'm just leaving. I'm leaving for my house, so. Oh, we're bussing? There's a bus. Oh, we're bussing. Bussing. With the boys? <laughs> no boys. <laughs> no boys. Fuck. Kate, you threw it off. I know. God damn it, Kate. You were about to be bussing with the boys. 
Uh, so what are we doing, TJ? So uh, we had Pizza Hut to sponsor the Barcelos uh, in- Invitational, and people responded to this tweet with them eating the Pizza Hut melt for a chance to be in Yak basketball. So we have eight finalists, and we're going to spin a wheel to find out who gets <coughs> to play with us. Is there any information about any of the finalists? Yeah, you want to watch the videos? See? Yeah, that would be awesome. Yeah. Uh, How many do we have? Uh, eight. Okay. The There's Vincent all the Reginators. Zacharias Rigonis. Okay. Eagles He's an Eagles fan. 8-0 in the bio. Like that. Uh, Two, 218, uh, brother. Uh, what, the for, videos? 218? Uh, yeah, basketball. Yeah. Wait, yeah, we're not watching first, 218. Uh, let me take a bite, a quick bite of the Cute dog. Uh, is that a boxer? What is that? Chicken bacon parmesan melt from Pizza Hut. I'm just pissed off at the first one because I know it's good. I know it looks so crazy. Mm, TJ, That's so good. let's do That's this. So good. Yep. Let's mm. let's spin the wheel, and when we get to final two, we'll watch mm. the final two's right. videos. Fair enough. That way we can, yeah. yeah. And uh, did we take off the asshole? Yeah, take him off. So this is an eliminator wheel. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And when we get to the final two, we'll watch him. So that we don't get our heart broken by falling in love with someone. I don't want to just pick a name uh, like Rick Gladiator. No, 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 no. It's a wheel. It's wheel. A it's the wheel is just the Pizza Hut wheel. Dunce Cap War. So no one hey. told you life was going to be a wheel. Uh, Mitch Gadsden. Oh, sorry, buddy. Sorry, Mitch. Mitch. Not your day. Thanks for doing it, though. Listen, if you if you applied for this, you knew that the wheel right. can kick you off. You know the deal with the wheel. Is it not just exciting to be on the wheel, I would say? I would, I would say so. so. I think it's I'd agree. exciting to be on the wheel. Also, look at this sweatshirt, dude. Look at this Christmassy ass sweatshirt. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Let, me see that. let me see that. Let me see that. Good job. Merry yeah. Christmas from the Yak, it says. Wow. Wow. Tomorrow. That's 10 a.m., nice. I think. That's not an ugly sweater. No, that's a nice Handsome one. sweater. And look, so the wheel says wet, nice, and it's landed a on naughty. naughty. <laughs> oh. This man's about to fuck. Someone's going to the coal store. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so it's coming out tomorrow at 10 a.m., and then it's 20% off for 24 hours. Nice. Oh. Don't do it. Just a little bit. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, it smells bad now. Oh, God, that smells We don't light <laughs> each other on fire enough. No, we don't. Especially this merch. When you first buy it, it oh, my oh God. yeah. There is a smell when you fr- well, I shouldn't uh, say that. You gotta wash it. A little vinegar. Yeah. A little vinegary. A little vinegar to it. Why? It's a little oh, you guys wouldn't have brought up the smell. I was just specifying <laughs> the smell. I don't think that's for everyone who gets it. I think it's because we get them. Oh, fresh off the press. Fresh uh, printed. Oh, okay. It's just us. To us. Ignore yeah. That. Is any of them girls? Nope. Damn. <laughs> Dang. But there, there, there probably, there probably was a lot of girls that submitted, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm yeah. sure. Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> awesome. It's just dudes. Got it. Got it. What was the guy who said he was the Brandon stopper? Have a Brandon stopper? Yeah. Someone said there were a Brandon stopper. I saw yeah. that. They're like, I will just play lockdown defense on Brandon. That'll be good. Right. They had a whole plan. I think whoever gets it should just try to try to lock Brandon down. Yeah. <laughs> good fucking luck. If I get the ball, I'm just, I'm shooting from wherever I am because that would be electric to make like a half quarter. Or going. Yeah. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm just afraid. thinking about how long this game's gonna take. Yeah. The teams are gonna just be standing there in the tunnel waiting <laughs> for us to be done. Let's imagine you're the last. Think we're gonna get booed? So, it's right, so let's see these two. Dylan Zeller. Oh, we saw Gr- Gr- Gladiator. We didn't see him, did we? Did we? I thought that was the. That was oh the no. Reginator. Oh yeah, that was the Reginator. Oh. I get All right. Those. So let do you wanna watch these guys? Yeah, let's watch these two guys. Yak invitational. Wait, why are we Tickets watching? Tickets still on sale. So we watch him just to give him a little shot. Barstool oh, no, dot link slash invitational. Friday. First game starts at five. Oh, oh I like oh. Zeller. I like Dylan Zeller. I mean, <laughs> he's he might. After two naps on a beach. He might be four. Eight. Look at this. That's a All right, man. that guy's. I'm rooting for him. Let me see the other guy. That's a man. That was Zeller. You don't know how high his shower oh, is, Brandon. Wow. You think he's oh. tiny? Right. Uh, oh, he's just a good-looking guy. Yeah, he might be too normal. Where's the? 
Yeah, oh, a, he's got a cute dog. Oh, uh, yeah, the dog. It's right, he asked me the wrong way that a guy with a burner. Wait, is that what guy. is that profile picture? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm Maybe I'm rooting for him. Uh-huh. Oh, no. Oh. All right, so four, first to four gets picked. First to four, okay. First to four is playing. So it's going to change somebody's life. Yeah, this is their moment. So they want it to land on them. They want it to land on them. Why do we do that every time? (laughs) All right, now this was the dog guy? No, that was the shower guy. Oh, Oh, you're right. That was the dog guy. Colin Zeller, shower guy. Shout out Pizza Hut. A guy. A guy 2 nothing. Hey. For any reason the dog guy can't come, it will go to the shower guy. Three. Okay. You have to have him on standby like a backup one. Shower guy. 2-1. This is electric for these two guys. Probably nervous. I would be. Three one? Yep, three one dog guy. Well dog guy. Dog guy. Three two. Oh man. No one's making a comeback. Dog guy. Oh Oh, god. Right. Bring your dog. Yeah, bring the dog. Rick Gladiator is in the tournament. Now, what do you think he said about all of us before? I'm looking now. I, was I about know. To look. He's scrolling through, <laughs> scroll through his feed. I need to know. Well, he's probably got a main account <laughs> that he uh, tweets from. Zero followers. Zero followers. <laughs> you know what I mean? He's definitely got a main where he's... Wait, what is the in silent beef between... What was his top's tweet? Is that... It? And the silent beef between Jerry and Big Cat Re- Oh. Oh, Jesus. Sorry when Jerry fired the first shot against Fields because there's no beef. Between Jerry might be your favorite guy. We literally just drove six hours in the car together on Thursday night. Had a great time. I don't know if I like this guy. Well, he's trying to mm. sow dissent. Let's he's look, one of those guys that makes, uh, makes a hey. mountain out of a, a molehill. Keep looking and see what else he said. No. Yeah. He probably has some. If he beef. has three of those, are we going to strip him? <laughs> He's gonna. I bet he's got a lot. Oh, he's only got eight tweets. It's a brand new account, and he started off swinging, swinging. Mm. You got KB? I don't know. <laughs> okay, this is incredible. Time. Okay. All right. Why is this guy so pissed at Sul Presidente? Okay. Uh oh. Oh, voice. Oh. oh. All right. All right. So uh, his only demerit is the silent beef. He's definitely got another. What is your guy. problem with Jerry? <laughs> Yeah. I don't like him. He's too short. Agreed. <laughs> so he yelled. Real nice, Dan. Make fun of how people are born. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry sent like such a nice, heartfelt tweet to me, or a, a message to me and Smitty after we lost. It's the best. Because he was just like, I know. He just knows how it is as a fan. Like he just is. He's a fan's fan. Oh, he kept on mumbling. He was like, and hopefully we never get to this spot. But he was like, if I had to watch the Steelers with Tico in the room, I would lose it. <laughs> like, yeah, we know. <laughs> it, yeah, that would be bad. Texans, Steelers, AFC Championship. I wish that on pretty much all of you. That <laughs> fans. Yeah. I want you guys all to have to go through that just to see yeah. see where your patience is at. Let's see how your patience is tested. If I were you guys, I would have just listened to the radio broadcast with huge headphones. Yeah. I wanted to yeah, be in the moment, live in the moment, feel the pain. You know what I mean? I didn't want the epidural. I wanted to feel all that pain. Oh, yeah. Get Pete. Cocky motherfucker. I can't believe he's still wearing that shirt. Buckets. Oh. <sighs> okay. Buckets. Shit. Sass, what do you think you're going to add to the wheel? I don't know. i got to think about it. What are you doing on Thursday? Yeah. What do you think you're going to add? Something good. Like what? I don't know. Maybe like a day to Six Flags or something like that. Oh, Six Flags. Yeah. 
Come on, it's KB. Nice. Water whiz, perhaps. Show us how wet you are. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, that was close. So no one oh. told you. Oh. oh. I did just sing the first part. I was with you. I you oh. It over. I oh. I was with you. I was harmonizing. Your life's a joke. You're broke. Or your job. Oh, close. Fire in the disco. Ooh. It's like you're always stuck in second gear. <laughs> <laughs> day, your month, or even your year. Sass, have you thought about what you're going to put onto the wheel? Uh, no, I haven't. Sass, what are you going to put on the <laughs> wheel, dude? <laughs> have you no, thought I'm about it? I'm still thinking yeah. about it. Think about it, dude. I want to make sure that you actually put some thought into this instead of just showing up and like bringing a granola bar and be like, yeah, I thought I could put this on the wheel. I'm going to think of something. How many mouse traps do you have in your house? Probably like ten right now. We got. Think we it would hurt if someone had to put their track. finger in one. We don't really have. No, big cat. No. <laughs> I was just, no. Yeah, what no. Was unrelated to the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> I was just curious. I tried to step. I stepped on one with my shoe on to see if it would. If I could feel it, and I didn't. Yeah, mouse traps. Not doing finger in a mouse trap. Mouse traps like, sounds good. Rat. Maybe it'd be like a hundred dollars in there. We got one of those wooden <laughs> rat traps, and that could probably take your finger off. Yeah, I'm talking. Those, yeah. Yeah. those things are like this yeah. big. If I put if I put a Chick Fil A sandwich in a, in a mouse trap, you would absolutely try to take it. Oh, I'd get it at lunchtime. Yeah, yeah, we put something in there. Oh, that yeah, you what about some get. kind of thing? Yeah, that's good. That'll be your. Oh no, no, see here, y'all go. <laughs> Seconds into the new wheel, and you're you're making it like this. All right. Well, the other thought I was thinking was like what. Could rat poison actually kill you? Yes. Over we time. We know that for a fact. Over time, it would cirrhosis. Rat poison burger? Liver cirrhosis. Have you tried a rat poison burger, Brandon? You, you haven't. Like you're speaking from experience. I just, hmm. I just. What if there was jalapenos on it? I don't no. like jalapenos. It's too hot for him. I don't hot do hot spicy hot. food. Jalapenos aren't that spicy. Yeah, they're, they're, I can't do any spice. Really? I don't like spice at all. The man is spiceless. You like mayonnaise? Oh, I preferred olive oil. I couldn't remember the other British girl band. Fuck. Spice Girls? What was the other British girl band? Band? Lilith Fair. S Club 7. Oh, that saying. Spice Club? Never, ever have I ever felt so alone. When you gotta get me out of this black hole. Who sang that? It was another. It was Will not, Smith. It was the anti Spice Girls back then. It starts out with talking. It's like, I need to know. Yes. Where are you going? Uh, Never, yeah. ever. Who sang it? Dude, I don't know you're talking We don't know, and we Nobody haven't knows, even, though. like, <laughs> no, hinted nothing. that we might have an idea. <laughs> hey, I and think we'll hey, you're, the one, you're the one who's got to yeah. figure this one out. <laughs> never, ever, have uh, never gonna, gonna get it, never gonna oh, get stop, it. Stop, stop, that's in vogue. Never that's in vogue. Get it, never gonna that's in vogue, stop. Never, gonna get never gonna ever, ever, have I ever felt so. All Saints. All Saints. Yes. Well, that was cheating. Well, yeah, but I needed to know. No, you didn't. I did. No. No, no, no. And when you said, I said, I can't do spice, I said, I prefer All Saints, and it would have been funnier because. Right. <sighs> I still don't think I would have got it. Nah. To be honest, I don't think no. I would have got I don't think it would have. Yeah, but it's just a classic Brandon Walker joke that only seven people get, yeah, and then they DM true. me later, like, hey, I got it. Thanks, buddy. Mm. And that's pretty much my, my lane here. How are you feeling about trivia tomorrow? Oh, good. Who are you going up against? The Honkers with, without oh. Coley. Oh. That's easy. Oh, yeah. Ben Mintz? Yeah. That's uh, it. Oh. You guys see Mintz jump into the lazy river? Yeah. I heard. Oh, I, I didn't see it. I need <laughs> to oh, see it. I, I heard there was, a, there was an agent of chaos telling him to do that and like, making sure he did that. Who? You did that. I was told that he said that he would do it if LSU won. And then he He's said just an he, LSU fan. He, <laughs> you see the clips? Yeah. You see the clip? He is just an LSU fan. He went crazy. His tweets. He I, he's smarter than I thought he was because he's a master marketer. He he pretended to be an Ole Miss fan for thirty seconds two years ago. Got hired, and is just an LSU fan. That's what he is. That's who he is. It he works. jumped. He jumped in the lazy river because they won. Right, and he was fired up, and uh, he said that he didn't say beforehand. But Tyler came up to me and was like, "Dude, the pen people are saying that Mint said that he." Was going to jump in the lazy river, so I just. But afterwards, video? he was like, "You, I, like I never said that, but you knew I'd do it, man. <laughs> you knew I'd do it." Hopefully, close. I don't know why I thought he'd be in a swimsuit. Or it's also, it's warm down there, right? Beautiful. It was like sunset. We were like watching the fucking games outside. I love lazy rivers. Get that ass up there, boy. Take a little rabbit, man.
Yeah. Yeah. Shaq just say that? Yeah. yeah. Shaq was there. <laughs> I believe in you, Mint. Who's, who's that? <laughs> I believe in you. Like, it's some yeah. difficult it's thing. It's literally a lazy rip. Going into a, a pool. <laughs> and so I knew you could always get in that pool. This is the longest walk to a pool I've ever encountered. <laughs> oh, he took the shoes off. Shoes off. off. Oh, socks? I really got to do shit. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Wrong. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Watch out. <laughs> right. Aww. Imagine getting swept away by a <laughs> river, drowned to death. The riptide. <laughs> It's and then he just the stood river. there for like five minutes without a towel. He just like kind of stood there wet as like security told him to get out of the lazy river. Nancy, Nancy, legend, you gonna get me out of this black hole? It's a good song. Like don't sound like it, dude. Never gonna uh, get it. Never really gonna get it. it. That's from like '92. Never gonna like get it. Never gonna get it. It's a very never famous song, and I feel like I, I'm not the only one that's going. Never gonna get it. Never Acapella gonna really get it. used to be more of a thing. Gonna I get it. That song, just never, never gonna get it. That's not. That's not acapella. It's a bunch of women saying "Never gonna get it." That's not. But that song has instruments. Yeah, but there's also acapella. Starts acapella. Yeah, it starts acapella. Acapella. Never gonna get it. Never, never gonna, gonna get, get it. it. Never oh, gonna get it. Never gonna. Get you're you're going too far. It's just it's. Never gonna get it. Never gonna get it. That's the whole song. Never gonna get it. Never get it. Ooh, never ooh, get ooh. it. <laughs> Continue. Never, never get it. Wait, hey, wait. What happened with Zion? Is who's? Oh, I think that they have an NDA. There was an NDA. A verbal. Right. A verbal NDA. Okay, got it. So I shouldn't say. <clears throat> I think that's just part of it. It's part yeah. of the biz. Yeah. If you don't have an NDA, you're doing something wrong. <laughs> Zaz a munch, ah. dude. Zaz a little munch. Guys need NDAs, <laughs> especially with women. Well, he doesn't. I don't think it was his NDA. Oh. I think she's still allowed to say whatever the fuck she wants. Oh. Zaz, on the other hand, lips he had sealed. to sign a. Yeah. NDA sex probably is hot though. We, we, yeah, we covered that. Yeah. that yeah. Okay. Sorry. If you you back. can't even tell your friends at brunch the next day. No. Correct. Then there's no point. I'm like, what's the no. point? She can no. though. She, the I'm talking about Za and his girl. Yeah, but say I'm LeBron James and I, and he says sign an NDA. To me, I'm saying never mind. What's the what? Point? If there's I think an the NDA, point is the is the sex. But then he, what's the no? The point is having the story. You can't I don't and know. not having to say anything to say. As you're sitting at brunch the next day with your girlfriends. You can't say that you hooked up with like LeBron James or whoever. I don't know. I'm sure they. T- I'm sure like they tell. That. Well, it wasn't. But can't you get in big trouble? Then? Didn't Fofia say that a couple of weeks ago that she oh, you'd been at a party LeBron and LeBron James <laughs> has sex. With LeBron James was like passing out people. NDAs at a party. Yeah. Oh wait, really? Yeah, that happened well, like that's two just an NDA ago. party. <laughs> they were at a party and like people, celebrities were getting NDA signed. That'd be funny if she did confuse NBA and NDA. <laughs> like LeBron James. But there's a whole league of guys with yeah. NDAs. Yeah. <laughs> so big in the NDA. <laughs> no, he's like seriously one of the just, biggest NDA players she around. Just misheard the whole yeah. thing. He's like the number one NDA guy. <laughs> Tim Durant. Westbrook used to be big in the NDA game, but. He's won four NDA championships. Uh, <laughs> that's a half court shot for Gonzaga. <laughs> it's I talked about the hits of the Susie Cross half court game. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> Wait, I, I got the book one, TJ. I'll send you. I got to start doing that. Just saying shit right after being like, I knew that was going to happen. I said that. I fucking, I knew Jordan was going to hit one to the moon. Sorry, Ron. Uh, actually, but I did say right before that, I was like, I got a terrible feeling about oh. this. I said that. You did say that. I did, dude. Ask anybody who was there. Ask Ebo. Ask Tom Lay. Ebo was there? Oh, yeah. His ass was back here yesterday. I know, because he had an 8 a.m. Or, yeah, he had an 8 a.m. He drove to the airport at 4.30, and I think as he was driving, Mintz texted him and said, I'm not coming. I, I'm going to the game Monday night. I'm supposed to be driving Mintz to the airport. Want to hear a psycho move? We went to... We went out to dinner on Saturday night to watch all the games. We went back to the house at like maybe eleven thirty. Everyone had a, me, Austin, and Jerry were staying at this Airbnb. 
7 a.m. flights. All went to bed. Jerry got a call from Big Tone. He went back out till 5 in the morning with Big Tone. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Man's just had a tweet. What did he tweet? Uh All right. I I don't know if we should. It's a tweet. Okay. Um. Curious. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I mean, whoa! <laughs> hey, wait, wait, wait! I can't be him. Oh, oh, oh. 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 <laughs> Holy shit! Wait, go to the replies. Holy this fuck. Jerry picture is gonna be used so many times. It's so funny. Go, no, no, go to the replies to it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> picture oh. of Jerry. This is the Jerry. best. The picture of Jerry's going to be used forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus, Mincy. <laughs> That's a shot. Oh. What are you doing? What? Oh. Why? Mincy. <laughs> I bet. I, well, he was trying to self deprecate. Yeah, and but realized yeah, yeah, that yeah, he, yeah. Right. he got him caught in the way, in the riptide. There are now 3,000 people watching Money Shots. <laughs> yeah, that was smart. <laughs> <laughs> Can we tune in? Let's Wait, is it going on now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turn yeah. it on, turn it on. <laughs> Let's tune in. Yeah, there's over 2,000 people. I know better than doing this. I hear you. That's why I have 21 plays on my uh, college basketball card today. Thank long what? people, home, baby. Let's, Let's go, roll. Megan. I love that love, about love you. I love to see it. You got to see where, you know, where, where, where these are all like quarter miniature unit plays, by the <laughs> I way. Can't. Is he I can't. I, I, I should have known. <laughs> <laughs> he's just getting hit. He's getting stuck. He's getting you know, sucked off. Hey, yeah, uh, oh, he's getting tough. It's about know. to come. Apparently, it's the McGregor video. I score up yesterday. I was right so off. excited to see, you know, the live odds during <laughs> Sunday Night Football. <laughs> in my bar, so sports, I knew we had a deal going on with him and stuff like that, but I had never seen it before. Like and I was down. so excited. Like, people were just destroying me in the comments. Like, that's been there. I'm like, Oops. are we tweeting yeah, money shots sure or are we tweeting money shots? It's okay. Are we tweeting uh, money shots as well? Uh, Kelly, I wanted to ask we can him get in there. Chime in too. Everyone, uh, retreat uh, Texas, Texas, everyone retreat money shots. Texas. Pull up a different screen, watch them, watch us watch them. I think. Let's, keep, let's just zoom in on Mincy. Yeah, he, I think he's going to check his phone. Uh, he has been. I think it's, it's trickling in. Why? I'm trying to give him one. Why? Why? Why, Ben? I heard that he got a crazy deal in a house down in New Orleans. Like a mansion or some shit. Oh, you hear that or no? I, I, I you heard a rumble. I don't even know what I'm allowed to say. Yeah, there's some. I don't, yeah, that's what I said. I don't even know if I'm allowed to say. I said that. Dang. NC. What a stud, dude! What a fucking absolute legend. You think he'll get in trouble for that? Nah. Who would even get him in trouble? Us? He won't. <laughs> uh, other, uh, none of us could tweet that. I feel a little can sad. Tweet that. <laughs> what about me? <laughs> you got to do a show with him for him to shower some right. kind of compliment on you like that. To compare, to lump himself in. What do you have in common with him that you could also, uh, he could compliment himself about? Uh, little butts. <laughs> uh. Three of the worst asses <laughs> in the company. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna fucking uh, love this shit. Can we go back to money shots? I you got terrible asses. <laughs> oh, is he starting to realize? No. <laughs> Wait, is, it, is he weighing in? What's he? No. Oh, wow. Don't worry. I still played TCU. And I'm oh, like, thank God. You know what? Nope. We're done here. We're, thank you. We're done here. And congratulations. Yep. And it's a confidence. Oh, win. So he's using it as 10. He's and wins. That I was wrong about TCU. Uh, he just busted. I don't <laughs> he just busted. Think TCU is a great <laughs> Auto credit Jack Mac. They are going to be touchdown underdogs to everyone else in the top 10. They are going to be nine point underdogs to Alabama. Just preach. This should be your guy on the hill. You sound very passionate about this. Yeah, Mincy talk? Segway. It's a segue. Oh, he's looking at his phone. Whatever. He's, they oh, couldn't even fine. give him a mince TCU label. Is a I know. <laughs> yes. A I think this is going to be a dog fight of a game. What did I say? By the way, Nadu nailed that bail. You almost got the exact game, score right. Will beat K State. Really? Yeah. Played pretty damn well. Adrian, 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 Adrian,
Did they cover? Oh. They were up 47 earlier. Did they cover? Yeah. Easy. He, uh, he said, I, I think this is going to be like a 110-55 one, uh, type game. It was 117-53. Jesus wow. That's pretty damn close. He knows college hoops, though, but I followed him on that Packers game, dude. B-mock, bro. Are you are you in deep with college basketball today? Yeah, oh yeah. I figured you were. Fuck yeah, I fucking I love college sports. Is the season sass? You think there's any college athlete is, who's fucked before you, Brandon? Mm. What? Has anyone, <laughs> has any college what? athlete lost their virginity before you did? What year was it? And are you talking about current college athletes? Oh, current college yeah. athletes. Mm. Well, what year um, was no, oh. that's not. It's not possible. Well, I think they're some, not like, born. Some Aussie thirty-year-old punk. No, I mean, I, 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 you know, talk about ninety. I was fucking in the nineties. None of these guys. You were, did you were? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. He's good. Oh, oh, you were barely, but I was. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Ninety-nine. Oh yeah. Y2K, Y2K, yeah. You slid uh, under the door. Dude, when American uh, Pie came Y2K out, we were all was, fucking. Why two K was a legit thing. Mm-hmm. Oh, I fucked oh, that yeah. night. Freaking out. People Did are... you fuck that night? Oh yeah, I was on a, we were in a barn party and, and when the when the thing went uh when it went, went midnight, they turned off all the lights like the world had shut down and we went home and fucked. It was fun. That is fun. You went home? Yeah. Why not just fuck at the barn party? Because there were other people at the barn party, Ron. It wasn't Live a little. But in that kind of party? No, it wasn't that kind of party. Do that you think... would that would come later. Do you think anyone do you think college football quarterbacks get more pussy than anyone else in sports i think mm. i think they um the gotta be up there I, I i think they're top five well you're forgetting about basketball uh bas- i was gonna yeah, say basketball. nba or that i think i think any don't premier league soccer guys fuck like i i, I mean, also if you're think, a college if you're a you good right. quarterback they're falling over themselves yeah. to yeah i think i think it's actually the other three sports like hockey players fuck I think it's all about how much you want to. Because college everyone... quarterbacks are worshipped, and they're fighting to fuck you. But, but it's also traveling, like the other sports travel so much. What like about hockey, cricketers? Are we talking baseball, about baseball? Cricket, yeah. What about a single baseball guy? He's in a fucking different city every night, or every other night for like Pat Burrow. Yeah, I think he still has to put college? effort into fucking. Whereas a college, college quarterback. Oh no 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 no, no pro. Oh, I'm t- we're talking college. I'm oh, like, women don't care too much about. No, I think hockey guys, dude. Hockey guys. Th- in college, a lot of chicks that just you still got to go out and get it. I think it would be a college uh, I think it kid. Comes to you, no, I disagree. Who's, who's doing? I don't know. It's all about how much you want to. NBA and hockey guys. In college, Tim Tebow yeah. could have fucked three times a night, every night, yeah. different girl. Like that Alabama LSU game was that? I was at LSU. Yeah, the quarterback could have fucked 70 girls that night if he wanted to. That's 7,000. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I think in some schools, like, the football team itself is so revered. Like, you don't even have to be the quarterback. You can be anyone on that. Oh, yeah. Team. So you yeah. are, like, and I think it's football over any other sport, college sport, college-wise, at least. I mean, yeah, I, I guess yeah. it also depends on what school you go to. I remember I was at a party at WVU back in the day, and there was guys on the football team there who were, like, like – human slugs, just like ogres, and pe- like fucking people were – they were cleaning up. It didn't matter. I uh, bet, I bet, like a basketball player at Arizona, though. Oh man, Richard Jefferson mm-hmm. when he was at Arizona. Yeah, like, he got uh, fucked. Alonzo Trier back at Arizona. Oh man, Tony Parker, Andre Eight. Oh, I think basketball Parker. too. You just Parker. see them walking, and you're like, that never guy's played college on the team. I don't he know. fucked. He fucked he's other people's wives. Though. Fucking. Oh, he was on the Idoka too. He's still, ma- he's not still married to the Longoria housewife. No, no, because he was yeah. fucking. I don't around, like the, how they had. Else the, fuck her? I don't like how they had the Evan Longoria and then Eva Longoria. That that ruined it for me. Yeah, I didn't like that. Who's either. The, who do you mean they they had who's the world? Oh yeah, the world got famous. That, that was yeah, yeah, that was, was tough. Too confusing. That was tough for us. I was out on both. There's Za. Uh, he was doing some sort of stream. Okay, Za. Okay, I see. Za. You, oh, we got Mincy Cam. I like this. Can we have him? I'm sorry, Bush. That's okay. But I will say. You're, you got very lucky with your Bears. I feel like he hasn't um, said that, anything. That, that was better, to, better to be lucky than good in the NFL. Well, he's eye is. candy. Yeah, yeah NFL, and he's just... Yeah. He's, my soul. Uh, he's just there for his cans. Has been through Aaron Rodgers. We got more about, cans than a film festival. Yeah. <laughs> and that's fashion. And there the, we go. The two turnovers there. in the red zone, and not just like losing to Detroit 
talking about a Detroit team that's allowing like 35 yep. a game at home and Green Bay scores nine points. Dude, if that's I wanted to watch a boring gambling show, I'd watch Pick Central. So what are we doing? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I wanted to see, want to see Mincy in the tits. He's talking Six about his – He gave us tits. Bag of at, yeah. at Washington, at home to the Jets, who are at, at a big win yesterday. But, I mean, this thing – I mean, the Vikings right, yeah, we're have, done with Mincy. I mean, they've already – Where is he right now? New Orleans. Oh, he's in New Orleans. Oh. He's going to the game tonight. He, he ah. couldn't come back because he had to go to the game. Superdome's going to shake. He's always got a little scheme going. He's always got a way to get back down south. South's always calling his name. Za, what up? What's up, boys? How we doing? Good, good. How we doing? I heard about your verbal NDA, so I won't talk about yeah. that. Yeah. Got, uh, got a little, uh, how do you call it? A slap on the wrist. Uh, oh, oh, that's oh, kinky. <laughs> you would spend that. Well, I mean, I'm just saying. You would spend that. Oh, daddy like. Oh, slap slap me again. <laughs> it what did Sean Connery say? I just like to slap him around. Slap a woman. <laughs> yeah, he said that. <laughs> oh, he did it. Dude, find the clip, TJ. Yeah. Sometimes you got to slap a it's woman around. It's the wildest clip of all time. It's as like, Bond? It's like was he saying it no. as Bond? Or he no, it was, a, it was a, himself. It was Sean He didn't even take a lot of heat for it. Oh, no, basically abuse. Yeah. Like you just got to slap him around. Fucking wild. Uh, Ron, you might have to do the rundown with us. What happened to Dave? Uh, no, it's uh, Ke- Kevin Kant. Or Smitty. Tell me. Tell me, and I'm down. All right. Otherwise, I'm getting fish across the street. What? From the halal truck. Hell yeah, you are. Eat fish, live long, You get brother. fish from a truck? Yeah. I like sound. that. It's good, dude. I, I promise you it's good. Promise? I swear on, on life. To eat some greens with it. It does. Yeah, look good. at this. I went for Chick Fil A today. Sometimes you have to oh, slap no the fuck out of a bitch. <laughs> a woman? No, I don't think it's good. I don't think, think it's bad. Must, I don't think it's that bad. I think that it depends entirely on the circumstances and if it merits it. Yeah. Well, what would merit it? Well, if you have tried everything else, yeah. and <laughs> women are pretty good at this. They don't they want to have the, the the last word, and you give them the last, last word, but they're not happy with the last word. They want to say it again and get into a really provocative situation. Then I think it's absolutely right. To give her a good slap? Yeah, absolutely. You should just slap what the if shit she gives you a good slap back? Well, then you get into another area. I mean, uh, then maybe she's getting to like it, and then it becomes something else. I don't know. <laughs> the, it's the last resort. He's not going to do it because he wants to do it. Huh? Wait till people see this interview. Are you going to get male? Might get some female. Yeah, that's what it. <laughs> oh, no. God what a line. God damn it. Jesus. God damn it. Oh, my God. Mike gets uh, he totally yeah. won that. He did. Fuck. Oh. Fuck. I get some free- yeah, and that's uh, way less intimidating than getting, like, canceled on Twitter. You're yeah. Like, physical male. <laughs> He's just... A cr- yeah. Wild that he just said it out loud. Yeah, that whoa! It's like you got to train him like a dog. It wasn't that big of a like. It, it wasn't a. Huge well, that last of line kind of he won the whole thing. Might get some female. Some female. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Sean Connery. What color? What color nails should I get? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go get red. This, get the red done for, this afternoon. Oh, for the gunners. Nice. Red. Actually, you're right. There yeah. we go. Get some bright red ones, go. bro. Do you have a game this week? Uh, yeah. Oh, is Zach, it's, is it's uh, troops coming? Gonna be a lot. No, so that's where I lucked out. He's in the UK right now, but it's gonna be a lot of pauses in the chat. They're not gonna mm. know what the fuck is going on when I show up with the yeah the red nails. I like that. I don't. When's the World Cup start? What? What's up? When does the World Tuesday? Cup start? Very good question, Brandon. Thank you. I, have, I have no idea. I appreciate it's that. It's gotta be it's, in a week or two. It, it is the most dead World Cup. Yeah. I I have no idea when it. I actually love the starts. when is the. I know the up. Premier League ends this weekend. I think it's a Saturday, maybe next Saturday. I feel nervous. It's, soon. For it's like Donnie. a week or two. <laughs> I don't want the There's day. always one one match that will stick out. Yeah. Uh, they'll they'll put it as a starter. It's usually November twentieth. Does that team even have does that country even have a team? Qatar. Yeah, you get a team yeah. if you host. No. You get, I think yeah. they have a lot of like. Uh, Here we go. Out they yeah. recruit it yeah. from yeah. outside. Yeah, to make oh. it happen. Uh. It, against Ecuador, that's winnable, dude. Dude, dude we got, we got a, a fucking Wales, Wales. England, and. Yeah, I just, it's so I weird. Fuck it's, up. It was so nice when it was in the summer and it's like the only thing going on. Now I'm just like. Yeah, if it's going to be 8 a.m., yeah. that's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to bet it. Yeah. I'm going to bet it. 2 p.m., uh, 5 a.m., no, bro. 
Nah. I'll be up at 5 a.m. to watch that. No, you won't. Argentina, Saudi Arabia. <laughs> Saudis. What's the first game we're looking forward to? Saudis. Saudis nuts. I haven't seen one yet. USA, Wales, right, nah. Keep going down. Keep going down. Win that shit. Uh, nope. None of these. Germany, Japan, little, is you know, Poland they used to be friends ah, back in the day. Uh, is Serbia any good? I know those. England, yeah. USA, yeah. Netherlands, Ecuador, I could get into that one. Nah, bro. You don't like that? All right, keep going. Uh, Ecuador. Uh, Argentina, Mexico. There Boom. you go. That's big. Mm -hmm. That one I'm going to get juiced up for. You're going to see full juice from me. That's on By a, that, I mean, I think that's on, Germany? that's on a college football Saturday. So there's, there'll be no juice. That's on rivalry Saturday. That's, there'll be no juice. That's in Michigan, Ohio State. That there'll be right zero there. juice. Spain, Germany zero during juice. football? I'm so excited for that game, Brandon. Yeah. yeah. Was, Portugal, was Uruguay? Popcorn. Yep. I, I don't know who I'm going to bet on. I don't either, but. Yo, should we all lock the door? Because there's a, a storm out. It's possible. Yeah. Should we all pick a like? Should we do some kind of World Cup pool or something where we all pick a certain amount of teams? Yeah. Like yeah. everybody on the show, maybe we pick them out of a hat and we have those teams to root for for the entire. Well, game. Yes, I like that. I'd like to do the food thing again if we could get more international. Yeah, we could eat it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we yeah. do world. Yeah, let's. World do world whatever Cup teams yeah. are playing that day, we'll eat their food. All right. So November twentieth. What is that? A Monday? Oh, that's a Sunday. Uh, uh, I think the nineteenth. All right. So the Friday before that, uh, we'll do World Cup Day. We'll do a World Cup preview day. Mm-hmm. We should pick. We should all get. Mo we should have all the teams accounted for. Or maybe we could do like a draft. We all get to pick. There's thirty-two teams. We could pick. Right? Are there thirty-two? Yeah, I think. No, but we should. No, no, no. We should get rid of the bad teams. We should just do all the teams that we think are going to. If there's advance. a draft, what maybe we could pick it. We could pick teams that we think. Yeah, well, yeah, we'll pick the bad teams because they'll be eliminated first. We could do the good teams later. You're talking about just for food. I I want to eat. Yeah. Yeah, I understand. Wait, how that. many of us are there? There's ten of us. I'm saying we need to pick teams that we should root for. The, the food should yeah. be separate from that. Well, what I'm yeah, saying is a, we should yeah. just do 20 teams. So we each get like two that. teams. Like How hard do we we'll, have to root? We'll eliminate all the bad teams like Cutter and all these teams that are not going to advance. Okay, well, spoiler, that was mine. Well, no, we're going to pick them out of a hat. Okay. So then what we'll do, too, is that day, the day before, we'll have Owen go out and get all the liquor for us. Owen doesn't, oh, doesn't work, work here anymore. anymore. What? Is that didn't stick. Owen doesn't what? work here anymore. He doesn't? I'll get it. <laughs> I'll get the what the fuck? Girl Owen can I'll do go. it. I did just realize, though, that like Owen was always the guy who went. I was going to yeah. get our shift. Fuck. All right, World Cup's canceled. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, no, what we'll do is we'll get, uh, so we'll have all 20 teams. We'll figure out like a uh, drink for for them, and we'll get them, and then we'll get fucked up on that Friday. Well, yeah, like a drinks around the world. Yeah, 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 yeah. I love that idea. Yeah. Oh, that's great. How's that sound, everyone? Uh, yeah. I think we yeah we each have a country. Yeah, we no two countries. We get two. Okay. What well, if they're opposing ideals of, as far as countries go? Like what kind of ideals? I'm oh, pretty you sure know what we can do? Alcohol's illegal in some of these. What countries. if we get Israel and Palestine? Wait. Yeah. I wonder if we can get. Does anyone? Do we know anyone who makes ping pong balls? Because that's how they do the real draw. We'll use the machine and we'll put the country's no. or we can just logo number, on it. Number the balls. If, like, oh, but I would love to see the logo so on the have balls. Somebody, we can have somebody draw it. Nick can draw. Let him yeah, you're right. All right, I'll buy some ping pong balls. We'll we'll draw all the flags, and we'll do it with the ping pong ball machine. Yeah. Oh, that's fun. wow. You're a flag we'll guy too, or just a geography guy? I'm not really into him. Uh -huh. I'm, I like memorize them, but My boy Wayne's into him. Let's also do. Um, not too okay, much. if everyone, if everyone puts in a hundred dollars, I'll match. What? And then the winner gets the pot. I like that. Oh, How do, fun. Hold on. So be the What's the competition? It's just we pick our teams. You get your team. Okay, okay. Your team, you win you the World shots. Cup, you get two thousand dollars cash. So everyone puts in a hundred, that's nine hundred, I'll put in an eleven hundred. All right, done. Two K cash to the winner. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's I like just that. made it way I more. Think we fun. Should get yeah, that'll be fun. Get something for each goal our team scores. From who? We should get like a free lawsuit from Morgan and Morgan, yeah. <laughs> Agreed. Wow, this is going to be fun. World Cup. Maybe we could sell it and there could be something like that or some shit. I don't know. Steven. Look at that. We just got a freaking idea. Damn, that was a good idea. Well, my coat for the basketball game has arrived. But then you could have potentially get the same two teams in the same group. We got to figure that out. That you can't get. Why? Well, I, I mean, that's just no, shit that's, luck. That, no, that's good luck because yeah. that means you guarantee oh, yeah, that's the group. True. Although we're going to pick pretty much all the teams that are guaranteed to go anyway. Which would be great. Yeah. 
Well, what if what if one of the teams a long? What if there's a long shot? Like that, that winds up going far. Nah, well, we'll have some sort come. of competition for it. Or nah, you know, there's 12 teams that have no chance, correct? Can we look at the field? There is, yeah, there's a bunch of, there's a lot, there's way more than 12 that have no chance. Go to the Barstool Sportsbook and look we at We could also all just get three teams. Yeah. It's probably about. Oh, yeah, that's true. Wait. Well, not, uh, yeah. Yeah. We yeah, can. we'll do, we'll, we'll all get so, three teams. And leave Qatar out and then one more. It's 32, so, right? No, Italy's not in. What? <laughs> we got to leave two out if we're going to go from 32 to 30. Oh, like Tunisia Italy and probably Qatar won't out. do anything. That Maybe the sense. U.S. Italy's not in the tournament. I said we leave Qatar out. Mm-hmm. Italy? I didn't say, did I say Italy? You said Italy and Qatar are going to be Can we play that back, TJ? Yeah, I think you did. Yeah, I, think I don't think did. I said Italy. I didn't mean yeah. to say it. I apologize. I said, so we leave Qatar. Did you say that? I said, so we leave Qatar out. So it'll leave. It'll leave. So it'll, it'll leave. leave guitar. Oh, oh, it'll this leave. dude said it'll leave guitar. Dude, I thought you said it'll leave. That's oh. fucking wild. It'll leave. Yeah, words, man. It'll Southern leave. words. Why don't we leave out uh, England too? Because fuck them. You know what I mean, bro? Well, like the, would, the U.S. could probably lose to All right, Wales, right? Scroll down. I think Wales I is probably works. pretty bad. All right, so Saudi Arabia's out. Tunisia's out. Costa Rica's out. Iran's out. Australia's out. Qatar's out. So that means Canada is out. Ghana, Cameroon. Uh, yeah, so all those didn't, teams should be out. Didn't Ghana have a run? So that's 10 teams right there. South Korea and Ecuador oh, the down. They went through a round of eight one year. Ghana had a run. They it beat was, us, didn't they? No. No, they lost to – that was the Suarez. Incident. Maybe we keep Ecuador in and then we take I Canada I think we should out. keep as many in as that's possible. Right. Just in all right, all three. All right, so just the bottom two. Just the bottom two will be out. I love the World Cup. But I don't like it being in the winter. But we'll, No, we'll get Qatar out. Get Qatar out of here. So it'll leave Qatar out. What? It, at least not in it. What if we leave all of them in? We each get three teams. No, we are. But I there's think two. Still yeah, two left one. over. Which should we be the two we don't leave? Which should be? The I, I think we should just get who we get. Yeah, but we don't get upset. What if the eventual winner is is left, is left out? off? I mean, it depends on what type of competition we're doing. I think it's everybody or, puts or, in or Dan's there. money. Win Dan Cat's money. It depends on, or or maybe two people will get. Four. Four teams. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so then we just got to find a bunch of drinks from all those places. Or a bunch of those places. I got to pay you again. All right, well, let's send How the show. Anyway, we got to do, the, we gotta do the, the rundown. But uh, all right, this is World right. Cup. Yeah. World Cup Friday, November 18th. 18th. I am excited. Now I'm excited. Look how fast What is that, that Steven? Yeah. What was that face? They're starting the World Cup on a football Sunday? Yeah, <laughs> real. Dude. No one cares, I know. But now we do care. Okay, yeah. Poor planning by them. No, dude, this is the, the most f- popular sport in the yeah. world <laughs> by far. They're, the amount of fans that the World Cup will bring in is yeah, some far Argentine. outweighs the NFL. They're wondering why soccer isn't big in America. We should also do I think they a, really care. <laughs> um, there should be a punishment for a team, for, for a person who has the, the least amount of goals. We got a tally. That goals. would be good. Yeah, the least amount of goals in the tournament it could be pecuniary. They mm-hmm. could have to pay some cash, or maybe they have to eat something gross. Like that country's, like we get to pick. We look through that country's food, and we get to pick one of the like spiciest or toughest things. Like Ooh. to go to that country, yeah, they go there. Yeah, they have to live there. <laughs> 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 they gotta go there. They gotta fly oh, they there and fly, fly back. back. They yeah, yeah. 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 You, Iran's in the World Cup. Oh no. <laughs> Iran's not going to have the yeah. lowest goals, though. Those boys uh, score over there. Uh, <laughs> There's one thing I know about my Iranian brothers, uh, my Persian bros. What could be the punishment? Uh, oh, the punishment could be that you have to watch the World Cup. Oh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah. With that Tico. A really bad one. With Tico rooting against you. Frank Shuey, maybe? Frank Shuey with their local drink? Golden Boot? But it's drinking piss out of Frank's shoe. We'll think about it. Yeah, we'll think about it. What could it be? See, Brandon said he had the piss, and now he's just walking around on the phone like it's Jerry Maguire. <laughs> Fucking show me the money in all over the place. Look at him. I started working out. <laughs> what I do is I take a corn dog and <laughs> remove the stick with my mouth. It's probably got some tragedy that just happened. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 to look very serious. 
<laughs> Brandon, you see, someone stole all your money. Why? Bankrupt? Why me? I'm getting sued? <laughs> Ever since I became king of the South. Oh, life's gone to shit. You know that All Saints song? <laughs> Never, ever, never. Never gonna get it, never gonna get it. Never gonna get it, never gonna get it. And his family's all saints now, bro. Never gonna get it, never gonna get it. <laughs> oh, man. I'm excited for this now. Yeah, now oh, the World fuck Cup. Bro. <laughs> I'm excited for the World Cup now. Can we do a Yak University, like on a pre- little presentation on your country? Oh, I like it's that. Like a- Definitely. You could do the draft. All right, contact. so then what we should do, no, this is what we'll do. Thursday, we'll do the draft. Friday will bring food and drinks. Yes, a taste of the, a yeah. taste of one of the co- countries. And, a, and yeah, you have to pick one of your countries one, yeah. to give a presentation about. So facts about all of them and ta- yeah. and a taste of one of. We got to get drunk. There we go. Yeah. Okay. There we okay, go. Perfect. That's a we got a nice little yak set up. Two two day yak. Yeah, I like that. Uh, November seventeenth and eighteenth. So why don't oh. you go ahead and cancel whatever trip you're planning for that right. weekend, Sass? No, I actually believe I uh, am in like. New Jersey or something like Jersey. Uh-huh. Yeah. So I'll easily Why you say it like that, that, bro. No, I just meant it's not far away. Oh, no flights. Mm. You don't take the chopper. No, the company chopper. Train guy. What are you gonna say? What are you gonna say, Stephen? Nothing. You sure, you we're gonna, gonna make a Kobe joke. <laughs> no. So fucked. That's so fucked. I love Kobe. Yeah, you knew he was gonna score eighty-one that night. I didn't. I do remember they were wearing the home whites. And it was a night game. I remember something was off with Ernie Els. I could tell before the <laughs> four hole one, something was off about. It. I, I, yep. Yeah, he looks shaky. Doesn't look like Alex himself. Haley. I don't know how far you are into the book, but what's your biggest takeaway so far? Um, I kind of just started a couple of days ago, um, <laughs> but um, I've read and a lot of a lot of notes over the years. Um, this is my first time actually reading it from start to finish. Um, but just a very, um, very smart man. A very, very, very smart man. <laughs> yeah, there's the, like the pictures they showed of him every time he's reading Godfather. He's on like page one. It's upside down. <laughs> yeah. Uh, LeBron, he actually makes me like him a little bit. That this that I was gonna say, like I kind of like him now. Yeah, like he it just wants people human. to be happy. Like, yeah. yeah. So yeah. I kind of like that. It's ind- something endearing about it. Yeah. I hate uh, to say why it. Why would you dislike him in the first place? I don't like him because I don't like Pat Beverly. Well, that <laughs> makes sense. <laughs> Pat Beverly's sick right now. That's like, Pat like is a little Sasquatch when he has the sniffles. I love Pat Bev. He's got all the dogs in him. Thank you. He does. Pat. Oh, he's dogged up. Yeah, he is. He's fucking... Dogged up. You see, Bill Simmons said that the Lakers are open to trading AD. Whoa. And that's coming from the sports guy. So you he know is the false. sports guy. <laughs> <laughs> the sports guy. The sports guy. All right. We'll see everyone tomorrow. Get excited for World Cup. I'm fucking gack World Cup. Yeah, I want to do like the drawing tomorrow. I know. I, I'm I so just pumped. Right into it. We made it fun. Bye. See you tomorrow.